But I will fucking set up, man. I go good. I good to go. Usually, I like to just drop it in the floor playing that, man. Just fucking slip on, cunts. But eh, fucking, you're saying whatever. Better which you go fishing. Yeah, it's to the kid, but the black cat, mate. See the white cat, not in Paisley. Aye. The black cat, it's a tribute. It's fucking in the Limwood. Oh, is it? Aye. Aye. It's just you get the river grief as well, mate. In Limwood, it's a it's a mere farm, fucking. River. Oh really? How did you do up there? Yeah, just fly fishing mate, that river's fly fishing, see the, the, the grief, it's mere fly, it's all fucking, it's all fields and it's all nice water, but if the care it's fucking pure urban water. Oh it's is it I pure Morgan with fucking trolleys and shit yeah, and all that and it fucked in it? I was fucking fishing yesterday morning, I seen a cunt with a trolley man cutting down for fucking Morrison's at Johnston. Aye. Like junkie cunt man, I was fucking, that's where there's always a trolleys at this hill just right in front of you, so you never flung it down because I was there, but I was there in the day and it was Aye, I fucking bad. pure poison in the water man, aye, because you always yeah. go by and it's always trolleys, old rusty bikes, fucking yeah. those wits, some cunt, a boot one trainer yeah, and all that know, shit man, yeah, pure bogging. Well we used to, cunts used to call the kit, used to be fishing in the kit. The wee guy and you'd tell cunts hugging the curtain, they go, What? There's nothing in that, no, 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 there is a few dead bodies for that river, man. Ah, you end up. because it's an urban river, not I mean, it goes right. The motorway falls it, so there's no peace and quiet on that river. Mm -hmm. I would say, but it's alright, mate. You know what I mean? Nah, just get used to it. End up catching a fish out there, and a bit like hanging out the Simpsons, get three eyes and fucking four tails <laughs> and all that shit, man. Be pure deformed. I know. No, that's a good fucking river, though, man. Nah, aye, aye. Aye, good stuff, man. How long you been going up there for? Maybe since I was fucking. Nine. Oh, have you? Aye, aye so it's aye, always mate, been so a thing. Aye, mate, aye, it's a fucking local river, not me. You could do sit there and have a fire and all ah, that. I suppose, fucking, mate, I suppose. Fucking chill, aye. That's what it was. I still date me, still have a few beers, could do have a fire and that, but it's just me now, you know what I mean? There's no cunt with me anywhere, every cunt used to be with all the boys, don't you? Aye, 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 pure team is, man, just doing cars and carnage. Aye, that's <coughs> fucking, that was always good, man, they had a fire, played the tunes and that. Some cunt was always, always a drama, there was always some sort of fucking drama. Ah, aye, something. always some cunt get a fucking call to him, innit? Some cunt bringing something up for like fucking five years ago. Ah, uh, it's always, always the same, innit, man? It's the gear, but once a gear creeps in, man, that's it. Once somebody starts bringing stuff like that, mate, it just creeps in, there's no just drinking and having a good night, you know what I mean? Aye. Somebody's got to take it to the next level all the time. Aye, all the time, I've been mm. fucking done it myself, you know what I mean? It's been a gear especially, and it's, it's one of the ones that does it, brings it to worse than cunts, and it's, it does, mate. you take it, and see if you're, the mere cunts you're taking it, you get cunts. And hussies and that, and cunts hit paras and all I've done it myself, hit yeah, paras, and it's... And all that, mate. All that shit with a salmon, you see the mad memes, what it's fucking, you see the mad meme, it's like, it's like eight lines, yeah, and the two, like the first two, it's like, oh, this is dynamite, then the next few are, well, I can't remember the next one, and the last few were peeking out the blinds with a salmon, yeah, I saw, that it's pure yeah. true, isn't it, man? Yeah, it is true, mate. It's fucking... Yeah, man, everywhere you go, mate. Well, I've, I've just recently moved to Govan and that, man, and fucking all my family's for Govan, right? And it is, and it's the same anywhere you go, man. It's fucking years ago, you'd go down, you fucking every cunt, you every cunt. Now you're walking down the street and nobody knows nobody, you know what I mean? There's that many fucking people from all over the place kicking about, you know what I mean? And it is, it's like, it has low stack community aspect. Like, cunts are afraid to fucking, cunts don't even want to fucking leave the house now. I know, I know. But fucking, it's a, it's a good thing and a bad thing, you know what I mean? Fucking, it's, I mean, it's inter integrated as well, you know what I mean? There's fucking all sorts of cult cultures, you know what I mean? That's it, mate, that's the thing, because I think it's, right now, it's, we really kind of start it, I think. See, like, the mingling of cultures, you know what I mean? Yeah, Every yeah. kind of, that's how you've got a lot of racial tension and that shit. A lot of people don't know how to deal with each other. Because yeah, I think, see, like, next, next 10, 20 years, every country's yeah, got yeah. to be so integrated. It's like the cultures. I think, see, maybe in about 50 year time, mate, it's going to, I think religion's kind of on its way out, I genuinely yeah, do, because yeah. there's that many people, it's just, it's, there's too much uh, divide right now, right. you know what I mean, I think right, like people, because right. I think I seen a photo and it was saying this is what the human being's going to look like fucking a hundred years and it's like everybody's going to look the same, they're going to have like, blue eyes, kind of like a, 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 a tan shade of skin, that kind of thing, so obviously everybody at some point's going to end up intermingling, you know what I mean, right. and, and it's only really be multicultural then in that like, 50, 50 years time, it'll just be wine cultures, you know what I mean, if you keep fucking, eventually it'll just stay that way, you know what I mean, it'll not be a multicultural, it's only just beginning, you know what I mean, for the city, say for the, they say the sixties up to now, everybody it's all work, that's why everybody travels now, it's work most mm -hmm. of the time. It's for every country, you know what I mean? So once it's fucking getting there fifty years of being multicultural, it'll just be one culture, do you know what I mean? It'll be the fucking one. Uh, hundred percent man, you know, fucking just, one society, what is it they say? The fucking what's that thing they call it? The fucking New World Order. I was trying to do conspiracy theories there. <laughs> I don't know, anything they've talked about, this is what they're saying, all that coronavirus and all that, but it's man, but fucking, it's mad, mate, you can read everything and fucking believe it or not believe it, at the end of the day, you're still waking up doing your own thing, like, I know, you're waking up doing your own fucking shit. Aye, uh, it's especially, see, we're internet and that now, we're in a pure mad, a mental age, I think it was Matt that was saying, it's like, yeah. see, we suppose social media and all that shit, right, now I think it's like, you go back to when fucking, I don't know what fucking drugs start first came out, 
generation yeah, didn't know how to deal with it, not I mean they just yeah, took it like whereas we know we can kinda take it or leave it because we know the dangers and yeah, shit. I know nowadays I know so you don't see any that means you can't say take smack young people who I've seen somebody my age so smack yeah, like we grew up with the, watching that generation, you know what I mean, seeing them all like that and the end outcome. You know what I mean? Who looks at a junkie and goes, I want to be like that? I know. I, mean, I, like that. I know. Aye, because you can think, see, when you look at lots of junkies and that, but obviously back in the 90s when Smack came out, that was the next big drug in couldn't you? Yeah, 20 year time, you're going to be fucked, even fucking, you're going to be fucked the minute you take it, but aye. how the, the uh, lasting effects is going to basically fuck your life, you know what I mean? Aye. They couldn't do that at times, so you can understand. Aye, but it's, as you say, mate, you're looking back at now, it's like you're looking at the country and you're like, ah, oh, fuck being like that, you know what I mean? So it's a, it's a fucking special type of person that still wants to take it, you yeah, know what I mean? It's the same with any, you see with gear, mate, you always see the good stuff, mate, you see all the, the Facebook posts and all that, the kind of like highlight, mate, it's just highlights, you know what I mean? But that's, it's, the same, it's the same fucking thing, see, you get 10 years' time, they're going to see, the, you're starting to see it the news, you know what I mean? The actual effect that's having on cunts, man. That's what I was called, war exposure stuff and all that, at Wim Hof. Aye. And that fucking, the loads of cunts are doing that, fucking, Aye, cunt. it, mate, I bet a lot Minus nine with one of my pals. I fucking get down to the water, man. You get in the water, my feet, my feet are in cramps to the way, my heart and up. But we sat in the wee bench, man, it was seven of them, mate, like, for sandwiches. No, <laughs> <laughs> did you know what Nah, did you know stick it? Mate, no, I'm it's hard. I didn't even my shins. I'm like, oh, God, <laughs> it was minus nine outside, so the fuck knows what the water was, you know what I mean? Mm-hmm. It was like, not a chance, man. Ah, nah, have you not tried the sins? I couldn't stay in it, mate. I think they'd fuck me. I think they'd make it look all fucking nice in the pictures. They must be fucking shivering their balls. Oh, it's like, hard. Straight back out, it's man. hard. I do it every day, but I don't go to the oven every day. I have a cold mm-hmm. bath every day, mate. It's hard. I tried the cold shower, but it's shivers no that cold, do you know what I mean? It doesn't go ice cold. Oh, like, and the bath, see when you're running the bath and wanted it's fucking ice cold, do you know what I mean? Aye. Nah, different ball game again. I'm like, this is the fun me, do you know what I mean? It's, I'm fucking that's it's it. It's hard, mate, it's hard, but you can find it. Have you ever tried the Wim Hof breathing? No, I've seen that. I've seen somebody talk about that. They've they, they, uh, cunt was doing it for a while and he's learned to hold his breath and all that for a good like, a good four minutes. And ah, you do it, mate. It's like it's one of the things it's like you fucking you do it, you do like you breathe in and out for the like, fucking 30 times and you exhale in the last breath, you know, breathe for a minute. Aye. Then you like, Inhale and hold for 15 seconds, but you'll like, squeeze, see if you're squeezing a shit out. Aye, aye. And then you'll like, breathe out, and that's like one round, so you do like three rounds, but see, like, as the rounds go on, you can hold your breath for longer, and you might do that, you do that, no right before you go in the cold water, but aye. do that like aye, and it helps you stay in the cold water. Aye. For longer, aye, so it's, it's, it's as if you can control your breath a lot better. Control, aye. It's like a diving technique, kind of, kind of diver's kind of technique. Aye, because kind of it's is. probably, see a lot of these divers and shit, they probably use the same kind of techniques, because see these uh, breathing techniques, they're like fucking thousands of years old. Aye, yeah, I know. It's not new, you know what I mean? It's aye. just, it's cause it's getting recently uncovered. Aye. But I used to definitely get into it. It's really good for seeing anxiety, depression, fucking inflammation, aye, but aye, all aye. sorts of It's really good for your body, I do it. Religiously now, I did, I've been doing it for about a year. Yeah, right. Get a cold bath every day, I'll not go a day without it. Yeah, right. And every day before I jump in it, I'm like, ah, fuck this. This is brutal. <laughs> yeah, and I'm like, ah, yeah, see yeah. if you're <laughs> radiators on and all that. I'm pure nice and warm. I'm like, ah, do I need to do this? But yeah, right. forced myself to date and see how much you date, mate. It's like a drug, man. You come out, yeah, you, feel fucking, fucking, you feel fucking amazing, mate. Is it to say, pain is pleasure or something like that? Like, that's so ah, pain is pleasure, that's probably the case. Yeah, and it's see the way I see it as well. If you're just jumping in a cold bath and say, I do, I do 10 minutes a day, Aye. and you start off, you, you start off a couple of minutes and you build up to it, I mean, I've been doing it a while, so I've kind of built up to that. Aye, aye. But see the fact that you're sitting in a cold water that's unpleasant as fuck, see if you're forcing yourself to do it when you're not in it, I'm sure aye, that, aye. I, I would think that builds willpower. Right, well, well, uh, any, aye, well, 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 aye, it fucking well, I mean, it's determination. Exactly, I mean, no, there's, I mean, there's me getting in, I can't even get any of my ankles, and then there's you that can fucking lie down in the thing, do you know what I mean? Aye, it's, but... It is, it's all about, it's fucking adapting to it, you know what I mean? It's fucking... Aye, but you need aye. to break yourself in it, not because I'm going to take it all, mate, I just couldn't do it, I'm like, it's not even, it's, uh, fuck it, mate, I've just no day in it. See, during the summer, mate, I'll dive off fucking, got Mill Shield Country Park back a lot, why not, mate, and dive off the water for up there, mate? Uh, aye, and no problem. Water's no that cold, it's cold, but it's no cold, you know what I mean? I'm not going to fucking sit in ice and all that, man. I can't even do that. I just can't even do it, mate. Aye, <laughs> yeah, I know, I know, mate. It's eight balls. I don't blame you, man. It is. It's one of the ones that it's think. Cunts find it in the rain time, you know what I mean? It is. It's one of the things. You see them at a cunt and see, like, Matt and that. I've, Aye. Obviously, he's done it before, but I'm like, Auntie Cunts, no, you need to do it. I'm, yeah. I'm a kick the balls after drowning, cunts. I'm ready to fucking throw cunts yeah, in locks, yeah. but it's one of the ones. I'm, cause I know, I'm just, I've, I've always, I started doing it after I was going to runs, and then yeah. I was getting a cold bath after it, so. That's how I got myself into it, because after I run, you're pure fucking fuck, then see when you go into a cold bath, you feel aye. dynamite. Aye. So that's how I managed it. I just after that, I was like, ah, see, after a cold bath, I felt pure energised. And I was like, ah, I just kept doing it for then on. It was just, I didn't like hot baths after that, it just made me feel pure sluggish. Aye, aye. So I kind of found it that way, but I doubt I'd have just started jumping in cold baths for the sake of it, man. I'd have been quite hard to do, man. I'd like to do it. I
it's kind of cope with me. Ah, just, just to your own comforts and that, innit, man? Nah, it's, mate, it's just fucking... I jump in water on the summer, mate, but no fucking the winter, mate. Aye. I know keep no date with a fishing rod in your own day, but a fishing mouse down there. I go fishing in the winter and all that, I'm used to it being in the cold and all that, pure hardy, but you know, mate, I fucking like a fire, like a fire and a good heat and all that. Aye, wrapped right up, didn't you, man? I fucking like, I like all that shit, mate, I don't fuck, but... So, mate, it's fucking... It's just not my thing, that's it, man. Aye, that's it, mate. It's, it's one of the ones, mate. It's, if it's no for you, it's no for you. It is, it's a bit of... Sometimes I'm like to myself, I fucking I feel like I feel like a yeah, fucking yeah. fruitcake doing this, mm. jumping a cold bath and fucking... It's good that it's good, but it's good that what it does mentally to you, you know what I mean? But Aye. fucking... Just no, it's no fun. Uh, no. I think mentally you're probably feeling better. No getting yeah, in and out. No, no, the fucking it's not even. I've not even got a comfort zone, mate. I just don't like that. Fucking just no. I just can't eat, mate. I tried it, tried it. Fucking no doing it, mate. Nah, yeah, fuck mm-hmm. it, it's one of the ones, as I say, mate, probably find you the tea, because I fucking work out, look, fuck no, and I go, I run that, do you go to the gym or do you anything like that? I started the gym, mate, they fucking, with the open day, you know, that Monday there, I just started, and there's a new gym, do it my way, mate. I don't want to go inside, I don't want to go I just started the gym in fucking, eh, do it my way in Linwood, mate. Muscle lab, it's called, mate, it's fucking, it's no bad. I seen that on your story or something. It was in there, and fucking nine o'clock, it was fucking empty. Aye? Yeah, it was banging, mate, if it fucking, they say that in the morning, it's busier. Dinner time was busy, you know what I mean? But gyms are all, mate. I, fuck, I used to go to gym when I was younger. Smashed it, I mean, smashed it for a good year. Didn't, I, didn't, I didn't hardly even smoke fags or nothing, man. Didn't even smoke green anymore. Fucking hammered it and then just fucking get, get up, mate. I'm just, it's always up and doing up and doing up and doing all the time. Nah, it's constant. You need to be fucking 100% focused. Nah, dedicated. On nah, you, uh, need, you need to be consistent, mate. Because I remember you were saying last night when I was talking to you, obviously, it's like. If you ADHD and that, it's yeah, like it's yeah. fucking it's hard for you to stay yeah. like focused even you're talking about like making tunes. Like you need to do it that week or you can always yeah, interest yeah, it's like the gym is a thing you, you need to pure need focus. to be fucking focused to a degree, man. Yeah. See if it's one of the ones you lose interest. I lose interest in shit. A lot but I've been doing the gym since I was like fifteen, so now it's a point. Yeah. It's that much a part of my life, so you go and fishing. Yeah, I've yeah. talked about the gym is for me. Yeah. That's how I can keep going, know what I mean? But times yeah. I fucking came off and I'm like, ah, I can't be fucked with this. Yeah, there's nothing wrong with giving yourself a break for you off things like that. When you do with your it just makes it harder for yourself, not when you do go back to things. Mm-hmm. I think that's the thing, man. It's fucking restarting again. Aye, but gyms, I'm going to stick to the gym. You know what I mean? I'm going to stick to it. I should definitely should, fat, mate. Man, I'm getting fucking. I'm getting <laughs> off, <laughs> but mate. a lot of lockdown, mate. Beer belly, mate. That's Aye. what it is, man. Aye, it's fucking. I mate, the booze puts I got in you and I have, didn't it? It's the eating bone, your booze, mate. I fucking. I was drinking 12 o'clock at night, mate, and I fucking see like a loaf of bread, mate. I've buttered full loaf of bread, mate. Ham on the more and sat in the more. Fucking, fucking grand, it. Honestly, and I'll be hungry again about 20 minutes <laughs> later. But I'll see before I go to bed, mate. I'm fu- I wake up the next day and I'm pure rough and I'm. Oh, it's fucking horrible, man. I think it would been rough when fucking just bevying. But Roger, I'm not eating all that shit, mate. I like, the bread, day, mate. Man. I see eating at night, mate. It's like yeah, I fucking yeah. come, didn't you get the next to me? Yeah, I try, no. I say that, mate, I just turned fucking about fucking three oh, fucking carnival fuck cakes, fucking yeah, fuck god, this, ah, uh, mate, I don't, oh, mate, I felt a fucking pure wrong in, man, I was mm-hmm. like, ah, eating it, see that way I was eating it, I was like, why am I eating this? Yeah, I'm like, yeah. what the fuck am I doing? <laughs> but I see it night, I see when you're boozing, man, you do get a pure special yeah. hunger, and it's like, you feel like you're cheating yourself, so if you have a bed, yeah, you're like, no, I need to have a munch, fuck, see, yeah, I can't yeah, just yeah. drink it and go to my bed without it, and not. I can't, I mean? mate, I plan it. Yeah, if I drink, see if I drink tonic, wine and all that, mate, I'm not hungry, I can't need just, just make fuds, no, see, and it's sweet and all that. I'm not even into sweet, see, like chocolate and all that, I don't eat all that, I'm not into sugar and all that, so oh, see, I right, I like bucky, but see if I can't eat, oh, after it, no, I mean, it's too sweet, or something about it, but beer, but... I mean, I could fucking eat my dinner and have a beer and be starving again after the beers, you know what I mean? It fucking. Ah, uh, if you're drinking the appetite in you? Yeah, uh, it's fucking. But I was drinking bad, mate, through the fucking. for the last year, mate, like bad, fucking like. Pff. Sometimes it was every two nights, mate, sometimes every night, you know that. Was uh, it? Right, but was bad. it you having just a couple of them? No, or just you fucking a, I'd on always it? go right on it, mate. I'd be on it, to, right on it for me, but any time is the fucking 12 o'clock at night, I've been, no, I mean, it's fucking one eye shut and all that. Aye, uh-huh. uh, fucking wrecked. Right. It was bad, mate, that's how I did put the weight on and all that, mate, just fucking. So went for that, we went for gear to fucking drink, and it's fucking mad, mate. Aye, eh? uh, cause you mate, see, we came out for gear. Obviously, I was bad with myself, man. Fucking, I came off it's puffing green. I started. That was cause it was one of the ones that was getting to like. A, I ended up. I, I was on it every day. Then right. I was getting to that point, I was only on it the weekend, and I was pure proud of myself, like, I'm only taking it the weekend and that. The only reason I was taking it the weekend, because I couldn't stop fucking taking it, I bumped that many cunts, you know what I mean? So, I, I stopped taking it, so I couldn't get it. Right. But then it would get to the weekend, man, and... I'd be, like, I'd be like fucking clockwork mate, I'd get to like Friday at like fucking five o'clock and I'd just get a pure, like I need to go on it, I need to get a bit of gear and that, yeah, and I'd yeah, get a pure yeah. rod, yeah. I was sitting with these boys and we like puffers and that, and I never really liked puffing and that, and I was just like that, fucking, Max, I'd draw that, I'd take a surgery,
So I've just kind of swapped it so I know exactly what you're talking about, you know what I mean? You're in a positive state though, aren't you? Like you're fucking, you've got yourself in that positive, like smoking that stuff, as it benefits you when you're in a positive train of thought constantly, do you know what I mean? Mm-hmm. Aye. I just, I, I used to smoke it, mate, I just fuck it, so I'm saying when it's, the gear used to hit the badges on the gear, and then fucking go to smoke that, it would give me the same effects, the same kind of tenseness and all that, or you would, or you would get a, that's what I'm saying about fucking being creative when you're on it. You'd I'd buzz and get such a pure excitement for doing it. It's where I'm smoking high and like, fucking like, writing tunes. Mm-hmm. I got a buzz, but I'm mistaking that excitement for pure fucking like something else is going on in here. Do I mean? It's a panic, so a pure panic about it. Ah, uh, you don't so know where to put that name on it. Try to put your finger on it, man. Nah, it's fucking mad, mate. It's just like sorty. Just me fucking mentally, mate. I'm doing, what I'm doing. Know what I mean? It's for the last few years, it's been fucking bad. Do you know what I mean? But. It's- it's fucking aye, let's get my shit back to gear now, you know what I mean, but... Aye, you're looking well, mate, yeah, definitely, 100%, man. It's because I'm a wee bit chubby now. Aye, all the fucking ham sandwiches, man. It's fucking takeaways and all, mate, that Uber Eats and all that, mate. It's fucking the McDonald's for breakfast and fucking lunch and dinner and all that, mate. You know what I mean? Uh, takeaways are an addiction in themselves, yeah, mate. Know, See if you ever try to come off getting takeaways, mate, yeah. it's fucking solid. Uh, you know when you're addicted to fall, you know when it's bad when you... you Takeaways don't even satisfy you anyway. You're like, oh, fuck, I'm sick of takeaways. Then <laughs> you want to make something for once. You're actually sick of it. That's how you know, fucking. Right. Right, you've been eating too much, you know what I mean? That's it's too easy done. It's too. We've mm-hmm. got it on a plate for us, mate. Yeah. You pick up your phone, mate, and you just. You, have, you don't even need to phone any kind, don't even yeah, need know, any human interaction, mate. Just like yeah. your fucking. Wait, stare like that, I know, mate. See, because I'm feeling with an so it's fucking the Phoenix. You get oh. the Phoenix retail pack, mate. Let's fucking put an order in when the kids chapped their door five minutes later. <laughs> it's quicker than the cabana that's fucking down the road, do you know what I mean? See, when you phone a delivery and you're like, like Chinese or something like that, they take it. See, before they get a new Eats on the phone, man, they're fucking at your door like that. Fuck's sake, Rapid, man. At the door before fucking, you put the phone in. Yeah. It's mental, but you get sick of it, mate. All that's me. I come for eating an always still class. It is coming all the way after they do this, this downward spiral. I mean, I was eating all the time. I would eat when I wasn't even hungry. Do you know what I mean? I just, just look for that wee bit I, of pleasure. I could keep filling it, I mean, if I stop smoking and all. Uh, for a good a few months ago I stopped smoking that's when it was worse again do you know what I mean the eating constantly constantly eating then I was drinking fizzy juice again I never really bother with fizzy juice and all that planning for cans iron brew constantly mate and it was going on to two litre bottles again and all that ah, I just, on, mate. I'm just <laughs> constant fucking erratic can I fucking just put myself somewhere do you know what I mean stay there I find like, like a happy medium just that bad balanced lifestyle I feel that man because yeah. it's especially I hear them come out for fags all the time, they always put on weight and that kind of uh, stuff. And plus, I know you're smoking, it's like your wee uh, like comfort, it's like a wee uh, fag, yeah. fuck it, have a fag, right? Sitting bored, fuck it, I'll have one. Uh, and you yeah. take that away, you need something to fill that void. Yeah, you do, you do, mate. I love, I love smoking and all, mate. I'm back in fags, I go, mate, but I like smoking. See if we could do a day, fuck out, you know what I mean? I would puff, I'd fucking, I'd puff about 40 fags a day. Oh, really? Yeah, I mate, look, fucking non stop when I day smoke, because I love smoking, I don't know, it's mad, isn't it, mate? My papa's the same, he just fucking loves his fags. Uh, enjoy it. You still always tell him, oh, you smoke too much, and he goes, you tell him he's got to die and he's like I hope so because I fucking paid for it not really <laughs> <laughs> paid enough for it I bet fucking that's the way it is with him mate that's what it's what just with me I like smoking what I mean but it's uh, the habit I think as well see when you stop smoking I stop smoking for a, I've stopped smoking a few times say you go you're going places you see you have your dinner then you need a fag that's when you basically need a fag but see once you conquer that it's that habit that's just a habit there it's no the addiction mm-hmm. that's the habit so when you do that a few times after you eat you don't think about fags anymore so I could be off fags for say a couple months and I go and do something I've not done since before I st- when I stopped smoking, so if I go see I was I had they been fishing or something, I'd have been out to out a walk with the dog somewhere, and I was I smoked then and I stopped all that time. No been there for months, and you go back to that same place, you need a fag again. But it's the habit; it's still creep because you're used to going somewhere. So you go to the motor, you've got routines. Mm. You know I mean, a routine ah, in yes. the motor, you spark us now. Getting out the motor, you spark us now. You know what I mean? The day things, it's always the same routines. So you need to kind of conquer everything you do. Ah, yeah, you know it's, I mean? it's, 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 it's thing, especially seeing you're smoking before the day. I was kind of similar to like smoking joints. Aye. It was always my. If I go out on the bike, right, I'll, get, I'll roll a wee joint for going out on the bike, or if I'll, I'll roll one, right, I'll hit, roll one and I get a munch, and then it's as you say, when you're going having a munch, it's right after it, right, your brain's wanting that fucking joint, yeah, or yeah. wanting that fag, man, and it's trying to get out of that, that's the hardest yeah, bit. It is, it's getting used to it, and it's, it's, when you smoke a joint, you put the tobacco in your joints? See, mate, I never used to, I yeah, never used to yeah, smoke, yeah. but recently, mate, I started... Get, I started enjoying see the the mix of the stone and the nicotine, yeah, yeah, and I was yeah. starting to learn there, and then I was like, no, see, recently I'm like that. See, let's smoke a joint without tobacco, and I was yeah. like, ah, fucking tree joint. Yeah. And I'm like, ah, but I don't smoke, so I'm like, ah, anyway, I'm starting smoking at 28. Yeah, fuck yeah, that, okay, so. You know, me, fuck that. Aye, but so I end up fucking, I'll end up on it the weekend. See, I go through periods, I'll, I'll be heavy sm- smoking the green fucking morning and the night, aye. and I'll just go off it for like a cut out, and I'll end up back on it. Aye, aye. And yeah, so I end up on it the weekend there, and it was building up, so it was getting to a point that I was like, right, I'm going to come off this thing. So I've been off it since Saturday. But I've only ones, I feel good for it, I don't feel pure. Fuck, I could go a joint right now. It's 
I get to a point where I smoke that much, so I start getting like anxiety uh, and yeah, paranoia. Yeah, yeah, so yeah. when I keep, see by the time I come off it, I'm like, ah, right, fucking, I'm glad to get rid of all uh, that. That's it. Mm-hmm. So, you know what I mean? But I it's with the tobacco. It's weird. I like tobacco and joints, but I don't like, to, I, I don't like a fag. I don't want a fag. Fags are boring. I mean, fucking, they're boring. You know it's, I mean? it's, it's, it's a different uh, taste, it's weird. I could yeah. put a fag in a joint and be like, ah, it's sound, but. Because it might blends it, you know what I mean? It's even, I don't smoke, I don't even smoke fags, I smoke roll ups, mate, because I like the roll, I like the, t- it's fucking, you know what I mean? It looks more natural, you'd say it's natural. Mm-hmm. Look at the fucking tobacco, mate, it's fucking wet and moist, you know what I mean? You know what I mean? So I was smoking tobacco, but when you smoke rollies, mate, you're powering them, do you know what I mean? You've got that full, it's fucking nonsense. Nah, you've got you know control of what you want, plus, I know it's no fucking filtered unless if you're using filters. Oh, I just fucking roached it, mate. I did, you know, it's your own. You see, when I'm out my steaming, mate, it's just fucking Bob Marley. Mate, uh, I mean, it's fucking it. uh, That's what it was. But fucking mate, it fucks you, mate, because I, I smoke, see if I drink, mate. See, like, uh, last time I was on it, see, like, last weekend or something, mate, fucking you sit smoke, I smoke on the bevy. Mm-hmm. Like, mate, I smoke a good hundred flags, man. No, like, mean, you're like, boozing, aye. Mate, like, and I wake up the next day and I can't even breathe in the morning, you know what I mean? I'm pure. A wee slight movement, my heart's gone like that, do you know what I mean? It's aye, fucking fuck bad, sake, mate, man. Aye. See, um, it's fucking horrible, mate. It's, it's ever since. Couple about, about two months ago or something, uh, the smoking got bad with the drinking. Obviously, we're drinking, smoking, smoking fags all the time. I think I got my heart, my heartbeat. See my resting heart rate, mate. Mm. I fucking check my heartbeat. It's, it's at like a hundred odd fucking BPM a minute. Does it? Hi, fuck mad, you know I mean? I'm fucking twenty five year old. It's still see, see if you just I check it every day. It's always ninety eight, hundred. That's resting. You know what I mean? Sitting, I shouldn't be like that. Fucking my, you know what I mean? It's the smoking flags that's done that to me. Aye, uh, definitely, fucking, man. You know I mean? So you've been having a few months, you see? I'm back on them again. Oh, you're back on them again. Oh, so you stoked for a few uh, months? Yeah, yeah, what I thought you meant you. Were, you I'm fucking, I've got a love hate with flags, mate. I fucking that's what I'm saying. I'd smoke flags all my life, mate. Fucking, I think well, if it didn't do to me, do you know what I mean? But it's that fucking. You don't really bother with everybody. Always, it's night time when you start thinking about stuff. You're lying, going, you're, 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 you're the fucking like the realization of existence. You know what I mean? Like, mm. I've got to change my life. I've got to date. You've only got this. You start pondering. You wake up the next day and it's like fucking gone. Ah, it's, about about you it's, fuck, like, it's like you're just it's fucking. It's me. You take everybody takes life for granted in the mornings, mate. You know what I mean? It's not until night time you really sit back and go fuck. You know what I mean? Well, I mean, you're lying in your bed when it gets to the early hours in the morning, man. You're sitting. You've got all these grand master plans, and you're like, ah, yeah, right, I'm going to yeah. change my life. You've yeah. thrown up this master plan. You're thinking yeah. you're going to execute it. Yeah, yeah. Next day you wake up and you're like, ah, where the fuck's that fag, yeah, man? Yeah, Geezer. Yeah, yeah. Fucking same with every cunt, man. Just back to the square one, eh? it's the same with everything in life, isn't it? Nah, it's, it's the it. same, mate, all the time. Yeah. So, uh, so see, also, you were saying about the fucking. When did you start getting into your ratting and that kind of stuff? Fuck me, it was an accident when I got into that one. An accident? Aye, How? It wasn't even really, I was never bothered about rapping that. I played the guitar, obviously, or something. Like, my dad fucking gave me the guitar. I was playing that over there, but I, saw, I had the reins and all that, so I wasn't really playing it as much. I was sat in a corner all the time, you know what I mean? Ah, uh, just a fucking ornament? Ah, uh, yeah, I, get a, I had the back front door, mate, uh, back in 2014, I think it was, 2015. And uh, with a big shed in the back garden, mm-hmm. so I used to get the boy with other boys running on it. We'd fucking, we'd sit and get a bevy, you know. It's a fuck, it wasn't really a bevy, or didn't really drink much, so I mean, smoked weed then. Aye. So we'd sit, we'd fucking sit, we'd do stupid freestyles and all that for a half, but it'd be like fucking, I was shite, mate. I was like the worst every could date, and I couldn't oh, even no, yeah, I'd sit and fucking, it was pure stupid stuff, mate, like fucking to- ranting about toast and all that. I mean, <laughs> <you> know, <laughs> just to make the first stuff, thing comes to your mind. Just that, you're mad shit, isn't it? Nothing that made any sense, you know what I mean? And, yeah, I see, he says, well, we're going camping, and he says, uh, I've got to write a rap, and he says, yeah, write a rap for camping, do you know what I mean, write, write it and get it fucking done. So I wrote it, man, and I, uh, when, I when I wrote it, it was, it was alright, mate, you know what I mean, I'm writing it, I'm like, I'm fucking actually doing alright here, do you know what I mean, and I was fucking enjoying it, Dude, it, was, it wasn't hard, it was like, we came, flowed, it came, mate, you know what I mean, um, and uh, I done it. I mean, I don't know when I let them all hear it, mate. It was like, oh, that's not even a joke, man. That's like fucking, that's a good tune, you know what oh, I mean? Impressed, I, I know, it was like fucking, because I was expecting it to be shite and all, you know what I mean? I'd never wrote a tune. So when I wrote it, and it was good, and that was the first one. See the Moxie Media? Aye. Uh, the one with the red t shirt, man. Aye. And that was the I've first thing that, 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 that was the first thing I wrote, mate. Was it? Aye. Fuck, see, that's fucking dynamite, mate. I listened to that last night, man, and I was like, ah, obviously, you could tell you were younger than it. But I was just thinking it was maybe like, because I didn't realise that was your fucking first thing you'd ever wrote. That was the first thing, mate. So where were you then? Yeah, uh, it was, I mean, 20, it was 25 in a row, mate, so, 2016 that came out, man, so the 20, end of 2015 I wrote that. So you, you wrote your first ra- ever rap tune five years ago? Yeah, hi. So that's the first time you ever yeah, done it? Yeah, that's the first time I've done it, mate, I never ever rapped, mate, I used to fucking put on air rappers, like, fucking, like, rap, I mean, singing a song, I just enjoy it, you know what I mean, like, I'd never ever thought about doing it, you know what I mean, I used to listen to Scottish rap growing up, though, and I always heard it, it was always corny, mate, it was always like, fucking, you had that, 
as if as if somebody wrote when they write songs they wrote it in an American accent and they're he you know what I mean he, then they did rap it in Scottish and it's like they're trying to rap aye, it, it would, just, it would have that kind of cringe factor it's almost it's like, it wasn't, it wasn't working kind of thing aye. it was too did aye. you ever listen to it the first time I ever heard a Scottish rappers it was that syllabus and brains you ever heard oh, them silly, aye, 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 aye. see to be honest to their credits see they came out now they're probably one of the best about but obviously they came out at the wrong time but aye, that's the ones that, the ones that fucking hanged the world fooled the world in it with the fucking ah, I kid you on they were from fucking uh, California uh, from uh, fucking Dundee uh, or something uh, man uh, there's plenty of cunts like them but fucking still these <laughs> days know what I mean man I suppose aye definitely man but it's that's what it is you hear it with these drill rappers and I, I mean boys from Scotland are fucking they're using their own accents, but they've got that, you can, I want to feel it, you're like, that's fucking dead English, you know what I mean, dead fucking London. I see a lot of people are doing that, because I think it's to try and get a bit more mainstream, mm. see with the Scottish, but I think the Scottish is going to get... But we're hanging, you know what I mean, these cunts don't believe in themselves, they're trying to just, it's, mate, it's just copy and paste, that's all it is, mate. They're just copying and pasting what's happened. The English rappers are doing it, I know, mate, I hear a drill fucking tune for one cunt in London or England, anywhere, and I hear one for an air cunt a week later, and it sounds exactly the same, it's just change the words, it's constant, same fucking structures and same things, and you get cunts up here. That's how I can tell when boys who hear, see when they're writing, mm-hmm. they're writing in an English accent, they're writing they're like, they're, what they've got in the paper, or whatever they're writing on their phone, they're doing it in an English accent, they're reading, and then they're writing it in Scottish, and mm-hmm. with the vocal, and I can, you can just tell it straight away. You think they, it might sound like a good tune to some cunts, but I can hear it straight away, do you oh, know what I mean? I can so just I can't hear it. I'm proud of where I, what I mean, my own accent, my own sound and all that. Uh, I take a proper passion about it, mate, and I've, I've fucking... Most cunts that know me know me know that I'm heavy against it. All the cunts that do all that accent shit and all that, you know what I mean, mate, look proper against it. That's your dead outspoken yeah. on social media. I've seen you writing a good few things about it, you know what I mean, talking about it, and it is, it's true. It's the only ones that's like, Scottish rap isn't going to get anywhere unless yeah. people start doing the kind of thing you're but talking about. You know I mean, look at Sherlock, look at, Sh- look at Shogun, and then you'd, what I'm doing, then you've got, Mel- you've got Melrose. You've got fucking, there's plenty of cunts, mate. Mog, look at Mog back in the day, you know what I mean? Every cunt was there, all that corny, well, most cunts were doing that corny American fucking baggy jean rap, and then Mog popped out, you know what I mean? Fucking, we came with that pure stuff, as if, you know what I mean? He had that like passion in his cell, do you know what I mean? You didn't even look at the paper and think, oh, I'm going to try and be this, or I'm going to try and be that. He just fucking looked at it, like, he wrote the tune, and that was it fucking well, there. I had the boss to actually try and be his cell, because a lot of the fucking, see the start of the Scottish rap, a lot of people, I think they feel <coughs> that to emulate, they had to try and be like, they thought it'd like be sound English or sound if sound something that wasn't Scottish. It's Scottish, I like something wrong with, you know what I mean? There's nothing wrong But this is the thing, all the, all the years of these cunts trying to sound different or have that American twang and all that. It's left gaps, you know what I mean? So see when, see when only the last, say when Shogun came out, and then we share lock and it was me. Oh, can I just spy it? came out like, hand in hand, you know what I mean? It was like a fucking a, a cog working, it was just like it all came out, say, for like 2015. Onwards, it just kind of bounced, started going for there. That's when it started die uh, gaining traction, I think, man. Right, because you see, a lot of you did like came out like, right about the same time as when news came out. Then a lot of people was and daft. Obviously, uh, you got yeah. Nero's and that. You've obviously got Zession that and Edinburgh and that uh, kind of stuff. You got Mog. He's fucking now. I just wasn't him. What was it all day? The guy wasn't fucking like the face paint that in it. Aye, uh, that's his new stuff in it. Aye, that's the man. He's tuned, man. I can't even uh, fucking name it, man. It's his old school stuff, mate. You need to listen to fucking like evolution and all that, mate. He's got fucking. Uh, Oh, mate, he's got some cracking tunes, mate, you know what I mean? Good hearing all that, mate, proper, like, proper tunes that's... You listen to it, takes you back, you know what I mean? It makes you think... The world really is, that Back in the old day, you know what I mean? We were younger. That's it, you think what you see, the world, we all like the... We see about us, you know what I mean? He's made tunes that made me feel like that was where I came from, you know what I mean? Oh, no, really, I need to give him a check out, man, right. because I heard one of his tunes, and I was just like, that cunt's fucking dynamite, you know what I mean? Because I'd heard him, obviously, Gary Fraser's pal of him. Aye. And that's the first one I'd heard his name, Morgan. It was one of the ones I was just flicking through, I think it was through the 1250 TV. Aye. Uh, for YouTube channel and that's oh, when yeah. I just see them pop up. I just remember they'd always say the white face paint, not I mean I was like, I've not heard them, I've heard them, but I've oh, yeah. overall agreed them I listen to for, not yeah, I mean. Good mate, he's old school stuff. But he's not he's like drilling all that, he's doing all this stuff and now, but it's just like his project, you know what I mean? It's his heavy project for him, but he's fucking his old school stuff, man, it's fucking un but mate. The real mate, you need to listen to. There's a good tune called Cool as I Can as well. It's cool one of as my I can. Right, it's, but it's banging, mate. That's, that's my favourite tune. It's not old and all, it's good, mate. It's got a pure summer vibe to it and all that. Oh, right. has it? I'll need to check that out. It's good, mate. It's fuck, his old school hip hop stuff. Nick no, could touch him back in the day, mate. I'm telling you that. Can't we came out with that Americano fucking. I mean, it's the fucking, uh, know what I mean, the same shit, yeah, and then he came out. A transatlantic just, accent. Uh, he figured it out. This is it leaves it all. These cunts are trying to do other things. We've gaps, so there's words that have never been used. Let's see words that rhyme with things. Mm-hmm. There's, there's so much to be discovered with what we sound like, do you know what I mean? And even, see if you're from Edinburgh, you're from fucking Dundee, or you're from Paisley, do you know what I mean? But all our accents are a bit different. Uh-huh. So words will rhyme differently, do you know what I mean? There'll be certain sounds you can enunciate differently, you know what I mean? It's ah, definitely. Like England's there, you've got Manchester, you've got fucking Birmingham, London, you've got fucking everything, you know what I mean? It's so other places, the accents are always different. Are you like, yeah, like Jordan McCann, like, can I remember one tune, but is it fucking, uh, 
He says, ah, shooting through the windows with this kid in his marron. He says, man, all of a sudden they say marron and all that shit. But it's like, he's obviously used his accent to kind of work there. Like, as an American, I'm living in a London, I wouldn't be able to make that work as well, you know what I mean? It's just mad, mate. Yeah, he's fucking. There's so much for Scottish for that, mate. You can fucking. It's still growing, mate, you know what I mean? But it's. If you can't just keep doing this drill, this mad accent. This, they can feel that pure twang in the state. There's things that you mean. When I, when I write drill, mate, I write, you know what I mean? I write, I don't think I the way, I don't punch lines where they're wanting it, you know what I mean? Where it's expected. Yeah, well, like kind of like Dave kind of wanted, like kind of way it's done. Uh, he hits it, but his stuff's different, you know what I mean? It's Dave's doing something different, he's not jumping on that pure band. Aye, but the thing is, Dave is his kind of in guy, but you see a lot of people, it's, they try and emulate it, and it's yeah, just no yeah. there, because it's just no him, because he's yeah, obviously, yeah. Aye, he's a fucking genius, Dave. Yeah, he is, he is, if you've got to see, if, you know what I mean? If you've got the real story stuff, mate, no matter what you do with a beat, it doesn't matter, you know what I mean? If cunts relate to a story, you know what I mean? If it's a good story. You know what no, I mean? It doesn't matter, mate. It doesn't matter what you, how you sound or how it flows or nothing like that. It doesn't matter what you've done or if you've copied anybody's flow for the stories there. Do you know what I mean? It's only your story. Mm-hmm. You can't can copy a story. Do you know what I mean? Ah, uh, definitely. It's real. You know what I mean? A lot yeah. of people can relate. Definitely. And it's it's one of the ones. It's like you find it so, about find it so about uh, find it so much about some kind. Just uh, for listening yeah. to their music. You know what I mean? Dave, with Dave, I feel as if I fucking know the cunt and I've uh, never met him. He's just you listen to his music. Obviously, uh, shit. He's bra, he's ma. Come the man of the house when he was young and all that uh, shit. No, I mean he's speaks for the heart. It's like you're listening, and you're like fucking uh, yeah. hell, man. And you find out cunt's only like twenty two. Uh, it's no, fucking mate, it's mental that man. He's like fucking. It's like, it's like see. But I don't fucking cunts feel like running about here, man, they're at age, and you're like, it's hicks a wee guy, you know yeah, what I mean? Yeah, it's yeah, fucking crazy. Some cunts have to grow up quick, and it's just, see, I had to grow up, they'd cut in all the veins, you know what I mean? I was fucking 16 year old, you know what I mean? Be 16, I eh? Mean, well, my, she, my missus was pregnant when she was fucking, I was 15, and I'd fucking, I'd even left school, you know what I mean? I'd left school, and she was fucking, my last she was born, I was 16, you know what I mean? I had to grow up straight away. I just had to yeah, fucking I mean. become responsible right away. Straight away, mate, aye, you know what I mean? Fucking straight into it, like boys deep, you know what I mean? Fucking mental, mate. How yeah. did that feel at the time, man? Me shitting yourself, yeah, obviously? I just, took it, I just took it day to day, mate. I never ever thought about it then. Oh, did you know that? I look back now and think, fuck, man, that's mental. You know what I mean? How, that, I was, when I was fucking, you know what I mean? Having wins, my pals are out. I'd take the dogs I walk, you know what I mean? My pals would be like, I'm, 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 I'm all going to like a football kind of thing, and they're all hanging about, and I'm like, this is mad. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> you're the field grown up. Yeah, they're going to sad when you get out to see them all. You went even walking away after seeing them for two minutes. Sad, you know what I mean? I was going away, and I'm pure gutted. I think to myself, when that fucking, that's my life gone now, you know what I mean? That's a, but it wasn't it going, it began, you know what I mean? Uh, it was fucking hard at the start, mate. It was fucking hard, you know what I mean? Because you're like, just leaving the school, because I reckon at least, at least go at 15, 16, I'll just go out and get mad with all that. I can go and do what I want. I turn 16, I can do what I want. I can leave, I can stay out whenever I want. That's it, mate. It's fucking, but it was hard, I mean. You didn't even think, it's not until you think back, but but then it just, it was day to day, it was happy. We had to eat like, two packs of noodles a day, you know what I mean? We hadn't done it, had much, mate. That uh, means we were happy to do that. I mean, when you're young, you don't eat much. You don't even. You're so you're nah, still used to it. You're it, getting comfortable, and you know what that means. You don't need money, you know that. You know what I mean? You're skint, all that. You then you have to fucking just get by, mate. That was it, mate. See, I think back to what I lived on, and I just think, how the fuck I did I date? You know what I mean? Half the time. And then when my wee boy was born, and then fucking. When was he born? Was it not after we last? He was born 2013. My wee last he was born 20, 2012. Oh, right, yeah. Eh? So it was only a fucking year, really. Years and a year, and a bit's different. Uh, Hey, but it was fucking. We ended up alright. We moved into a nice wee back front door, man. But the landlord was a fucking prick, mate. You know what I mean? Was it? Ah, he didn't fix it. You know what I mean? It was a fucking the roof. The roof in the house was bevelled in. Oh, was it? Aye. Fucking water passing through every time it fucking rained. You know what I mean? They can't eventually get a cunt to come out to fix it, mate. They can't come out with one tile. And I'm like, ah, mate, they need a whole fucking roof. <laughs> you know what I mean? It's like, look, you can't cut rent, man. Do you know what I mean? But fucking, I ended up buying a boat. I'm fucking. Bought a big uh, Mitsubishi, big space star thing, man. I didn't have a license for motors, mate. So I used to drive about foot licenses and all that, mate. Fucking. Ah, pure red talk, nah, just looking at a fuck. guy, you know what I mean? Ah, fucking. Nah, it's not even get a motor, that mate. Fuck, get a license, I want a motor. <laughs> used to take my pals and all that, mate. I did bits. It was like a big fucking van thing, man. I used to take them drives, we used to. You can go fishing and all that, mate. Drive everywhere to get the back of Houston, see, because, like, I mean, it's fucking ah, up the hills, man. Fucking rallying it, mate. Rallying it, mate. I miss my wee guy. It's like a big fucking old two foot with a teep deck bit and all that, mate. I mean, it's like. <laughs> I did it, man. Pure old, red snow as fuck. You're old as fuck, mate. One of the teep decks, you need to eject yeah, it every time you leave the van, so something does the bump it. It was fucking mad, mate. Uh, it was mad, but, mate. I fucking used to love driving about like that, but that's fucking. I failed my test though when I did the. I mean, I done lessons and then done my test. I failed it still. You know what I mean? Shut I've like, been you? driving all the years. I'm like, what the fuck's going on? You know what I mean? Fuck's fucking, sake! Would they uh, fail you for? Oh, it's because I never braked. It was a burn of van, mate. They said I braked too late a wee bit. I'm like, oh, did I right. fuck? You know what I mean? They said you had to touch the brake. So when I touched up the brake, ah, you need to show as if like, you need to like be as if you're aware of like, your planning brake and all that shit. Cause okay. obviously you're.
felt the stick needing the cunt. I fucking that. I fucking learned that. I mean, I'd have fucking composed myself and that. was blaming my fucking man. The cunt that does the lessons and that. I'm blaming him and all that. Okay, I was fucking off. I was going to have my up, mate. I get pure angry, pure easy sometimes. You know what I mean? Let's see if I'm hungry, mate. Fucking angry. Oh, heavy, angry. Fucking tell that guy there, mate. He's a heavy, angry man. He's in Asia. I mean, I get pure stuff. You're like, fucking hell, man. I need a fucking scram. That's what I do. My boss is at a table. I'm going to put my up and I'm quiet or something. She's like, I take it you've no weight today. <laughs> uh, it's fucking, I've always had to get to eat, mate. My fids off, my fucking grub. Ah, oh, I see, mate, mate. I fucking eat what's going out of fashion, man. I kind of sick myself with it. Take, well, just start it up with the fucking shite I eat, man. But yeah, it's fucking, I, I pure. I get, a, I go through stages, man. I'll go, I'll eat like a pure monk and I'll be yeah, pure proud yeah, myself yeah, for yeah. like two days. And then I'll celebrate by getting a fucking milkshake and nah, yeah, a cake, man, man and I'll feel <laughs> fuck it and I'll feel like shite. Yeah, but that stuff makes you feel like shite, man. That fucking it's crazy, mate, what it does to your mind, mate. Man, see, you're fucking. The sh- the f- it's weird, yeah, like, yeah, how much. I didn't realise it was quite recently, mate, how much fucking food affects your mood. Ah, yeah, it does, mate, it does. It's crazy, man, like fucking yeah. how I mean, I'd make the shite out of it and yeah. the shite out of it. I mean, I used to do and called Bam versus Food. I used to go on Facebook Live and this Indian, this local Indian used to give me mad munchies for nothing and I'd eat it and slaughter cunts you on the live thing, you know, uh, and that was my yeah. pure thing. I mean, you might have seen some of these big Egyptian kebabs, man. It was fucking banging munchies. But Is that the big man? Is that the big fucking... It's like a 10-inch box with a big yeah, nan yeah, bread yeah, like yeah, fucking yeah, donor yeah, meat yeah. spicy. Mate, it's fucking beautiful, but yeah, it's for yeah, like three yeah. cunts or something and I'm pure eating it in the water. So obviously, I, you know, back then, see, obviously, when you moved into your gas, so I, cause I was talking to somebody, see, obviously, it was that Gary Faison, that they were telling us about... I'm not getting any range, so I don't, I don't know, no, but it's like when you do have become a dad, it does it, yeah, it changes you a degree, it kills your ego. Uh, yeah, obviously, I, but you're at that young I age. I was that young, I mean, I didn't have an ego. Not, uh, uh, you don't age, get to that I mean, stage uh, where you, you get an ego, it's when you get uh, to 17, 18, you think you're the fucking boy, you know that shit, man. Uh, you kinda, I was quite a deep thinker at that age, you know what I mean? I know, mate, so it was fucking like. I would think, you know what I mean? I was dead fucking focused and all that. I could read cunts like a book and all, still kidding, you know what I mean? Fuck, nah, you seem that way when you're talking about fucking with rappers and that kind of shit. You see, you see the kind of one you can fucking you can see through the facade. Yeah, they, they know, I don't even tell me. I just need time for cunts when I know, and if I know what they're like, you know what I mean? If I just fucking, they'll, they'll know, I know, do you know what I mean? Nah, you'll know, make it, you know, keep a secret, yeah, you'll yeah, kind of yeah. like, give that fucking yeah, kind of vibe off. Yeah, but there's good cunts, mate. Most cunts I have met have been good cunts, you know what I mean? I went, used to go out at sketchy beats and fucking. A cafe, basement thing. She did all the gigs and all that, mate. It's a fucking crack then. Oh, the is that aye? Like a wee underground thing? Mate, if you could suck in all the wee back door, but every cunt smoke, mate, you get a couple of those and every cunt's in chuffing snout and taking lines right in the middle of that. I mean, fucking all sorts of shit's going on, mate. <laughs> I mean, that's when I started taking all the beats right enough, man. I mean, it is, mate. There's cunts just steaming, doing fucking, like, I mean, the open mics, fucking up ranting and all that, mate. And the naked cunts aren't watching them, man. They're all just in the toilet, crumbed in a toilet, sniffing bats. <laughs> I mean, that's what it was, mate. Couldn't as well pull an amp into the toilet and rat them nah, in there. Fucking mad. They're always a pure mess, mate. I see, thank God, it was class, mate, but it ruined me in that place, mate. You've sent me right down a downward spiral with the drugs and all that, man, like proper did. Because I remember you saying, uh, you never used to fucking touch the gear or that until that kind of. Yeah, yeah, because I really bored, mate. I was against it. I used to call my pals junkies. For taking it, you know what I mean? Fucking, so they slaughter them like, yeah, junkie bastard, look at you, you know that. We used to go camping, they'd bring fucking, they're like, my pals would bring it, and they'd be like, yeah, fucking junk, be a junk boy, and all that, you know what I mean? Proper slagging them. And then, for you know me, but when they took you, mate, it's fucking like the best, it was the best feeling ever, do you know what I mean? I'm like, holy, it's, it is, mate, this is why, it's a good feeling, mate, for 10 minutes now. But right. back then, when you took it, it was all night, you know what I mean? Ah, it was like fucking woof, like, you're, I fucking love this shit, you know what I mean? That's what it's uh, attractive. But then eventually, you keep taking it so much, it's only 10 minutes, there, buzz. Then I would start setting in and all that. There's always a tight chest. I would always do all this and sit with a bad posture and all that and start to eat away at myself and all that. Start too much, you're consumed with it, you know what I mean? Ah, uh, you would put yeah. you in that way. Yeah, I was kind of like that. Yeah, see if I fucking sniff gear, I go, I'm mad. I sit in a corner and I can't kind of talk to cunts. Yeah, you can't yeah, try and talk to me. I'm pure standoff. It's a, yeah, yeah. Just what I sit and no be fucking yeah, a yeah. part of the company or that. I'm just. Fucking wait, it's like you're dead fucking right. closed in, man. You it's like be, you can either be open, you can be all talky, or you can be one of the ones where you just you try and crack a smile on your face is twitching and all that. You're trying to laugh at something, you know what that's funny anymore. You know I mean, there's no can not crack a joke, you're like, uh, uh, <laughs> your eyes twitching because you're trying to crack a <laughs> smile, you know what I mean? It's fucking that is bad stuff, mate, but it's I used to mate fucking I get really bad with it, mate. But fucking so yeah. long ago was that when obviously you were going to the sketchy beats and that and then obviously this all started kinda of happening. So long ago was that like, fucking can you tell you, mate, it was the year 2017 or 2018, mate, I don't even I didn't keep track of years, not a minute. That's, that's weird, man, I was having a bad gig with the gear, it was 2017, I don't know, uh, 2000s, uh, roughly about, 2000, uh, 2017, roughly about, into 2018, so it was uh, yeah, summer 2017, get to, like, like, a year later, 
Then it was two thousand. End of two thousand eighteen. I started puffing. Last yeah, summer, yeah. run about in. So about a year, I'd say. Yeah, so yeah, I'm roughly yeah. about the same time. Yeah, he's fucking. He was on for he was on for a long time. You know what I mean, it went through there, and then it was it gradually built up. Do you know what I mean? It was becoming once every so often. Then you had it. You know what I mean? You had the stuff, and then you're fucking. Oh, it's all the time. You know what I mean? Aye, you fucking lose kids, mate. I had fucking pals who were all stoners. You know what I mean? I'm telling them I'm fucking I'm I'm fucking bad now, do you know what I mean? And they know I'm bad, everything know I'm bad. Mate, these cunts fucking patch you. They leave you alone, you know what I mean? But that's the fucking you're the dane every cunt's nothing on this stuff, mate. You don't realise you're actually dane cunts and that's in, you know what I mean? You, think you you're become the problem nothing. and you think when everybody leaves you they're all snakes, oh you're all snake and all that. It's when they've stopped talking to you, mate, you lose contact with I've lost a lot of cunts, mate, you know what I mean? I've lost all of them, every cunt, you know what I mean? But it's my own fault, but I don't get a fuck to the end of the day, you know what I mean? Ah, it's funny, it's man, don't like you, dude. Have you not tried to fucking get in contact, let's see, since you've obviously got your silly girl on that shit, yeah. as a man of man's kind of like, oh, listen... See, I just thought they were in the avenues now, mate, the people up, I was doing the rain things, mate, it's all positive stuff, you know what I mean? Mm. Like, you can't, you can't, I can't drag cunts to the farm, do you know what I mean? I'm up and doing all the time. Aye. I prefer me having cunts from me constantly being pure negative, you know what I mean? Aye. I hate cunts coming to me with negative stuff all the time. And it's if you're just having a good day and come cunt, because then it's all put on you, do you know what I mean? That's what I was doing to every cunt. All the time, it was always pure, oh, me, 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 fucking. So it's bad, mate. Nah, it does. It makes you that kind of way. It's crazy. It does bring it. Well, you think it's a pure false, false sense of security, as. You see, the first time you take it, it's dynamite. Your last is a pure wonder drug. And as you say, as time goes on, I remember the first time when I fucking really experienced like, the fucking the pure de- depression again. It was like fucking about five years ago, five, six years ago. Aye. I was uh, working, did a straight demolition job. And I had the, the bright idea. I'll take an ounce of prop off some cunt and quit my job and start putting. Uh, yeah, That's yeah, a good yeah. idea, not. I mean, yeah, I'll do that, and that means I'm running to work and I'll be yeah, packing. Yeah. Obviously, never happened. I was yeah, just hammering the gear like fuck. Like and I remember it. fucking got to the doctor, fucking. And I was like, ah, man, my head's up my ass, man. Fuck, obviously, I didn't know it was the gear, it was there. Yeah, I, didn't, yeah. I wasn't that clued up in it then. Nah, I just stoked up at it. I knew my Irish guy. I was sitting telling me about it and he's like, listen, he's like, I've got guys coming in here all the time. He's like, I did the team yeah. drugs at the weekend and they come in and their their heads up there. Like, Just take a wee weekend off it not. And I was like, Aye. and he's like, he's like, Do you want a wee line? And I'm like, ah! <laughs> that's like, a sick line. And I'm like, oh, alright, fuck's sake, man. I was like, I fucking eyes feel lit up, but I that's when I had my first kind of spell, mate, you know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, and then I was like, ah, but you think I had to learn my lesson but then, but I yeah, it was obviously and it's one of the ones I was like young at the time see when you're obviously at young age every cunt yeah, staying yeah. at Rooney and it's like you get away with it when you're younger I think so you get out nah, and sniffing gear it's the, the priority you know what I mean when you're a grown adult you've got, you wake up to and you meet you're doing you're feeling one doing and you get to your weekend you have a good weekend and that but during the Monday you know, you know Monday's coming you know what I mean your whole week's coming every responsibilities and all that mm. and with that fucking I mean it, it creeps on you especially with yourself you get two veins yeah, no, three I mean, veins I get three oh, you get three veins yeah, yeah, so when did you have the third vein yeah he was born he was, he's, he's coming up for two mate Oh, is he so I uh, just recently October, then? Aye, brilliant, man. I've got three dunks in all, mate. But I fucking love that. Fuck's sake, man. Dunks are easier than wins, mate. Dunks are easier than wins. I think so, aye. Aye, need to fucking t- t- train a dog in about a year, you know what I mean? Wins are a fucking f- a lifetime ah, of responsibility, suppose. you know what I mean? Even when they're grown men, you still have to look after them, you know what I mean? I it's going to be that way. Aye, right enough, man. Because I always like, it's like, see people get dug it, it's like fucking taking one away, innit? But you're right, I mean, you see how you could train a, d- a dog in a year, then after a year, probably it's easier, but wins. You have a win for a year, then it's getting into yeah. one, then terrible yeah, twos, yeah, and you need, you're dealing with a, a, a person growing, yeah. and as you say, as you get to like, then you deal with the grown up as a child, then you get to like 16, you start rebelling all that yeah, shit, man, yeah, you need yeah, to deal yeah. with that, it's just a yeah, pure, yeah. it's a heavy yeah, lifetime yeah. of shit, well, man. Asses, she's fucking, she can be hard work, man, she was going to be trouble when she's 12, know what I mean? Oh, a wee diva. Nah, a wee diva, she's dead <laughs> dramatic and all that. Oh, she's is like, she, aye? Aye, uh, she's always like that, mate, she's just for your bones, she could not be or something and all that, she's like, I'm not doing anything for you ever again, you know what I mean? Don't ask me to do anything. She'll put that on you. She puts it, she does, mate, but she's always like that, she gets it for more, but... Did you have wings in that? Obviously, did they know obviously what you're into your rat and that kind of stuff? Nah, they, they, know, to... aye, they know, they know about it. Oh, my wee boy, nah. he's always in, he was fucking, he just likes M&M and all that, you know what I mean? Oh, fucking, aye, he's got good taste in. Yeah, he always goes, Dad, you're a rapper, you know what? He's wee pals, I'm like, I'm a rapper. Like that. <laughs> Every <laughs> cunt's call me a rapper, I'm not a rapper, mate, you know what I mean? If someone's going, he's a rapper, I'm like, I'm not a rapper, I'm not a rapper, I'm not a rapper. I'm not a rapper. Make tunes now and again, you know what uh, I mean? I'm not a full time rapper, mate, I'm a fucking nut. Just day what I do, you know what I mean? Aye, my just... life's more in. I'm with and doing what I'm doing, you know what I mean? All that, like, the, 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 the rapping's just a wee thing in the corner, do you know what I mean? Aye, it's all your fo- soul focus, you like your family, your fishing and all that kind of you stuff. Can I just take the risk, mate, and give patch everything, no make money, no do fuck all, mate, and chase music, do you know what I mean? Like, I'm like a pure bum, Aye. you know what I mean? Uh, it's easy to do, obviously, if you've not got responsibility, but like yeah, I say, you've got a house, you get wings, you get dogs, and all that shit,
fuck all, I'm fine and struggling for time to do uh, shit, you yeah. know what I mean? I can imagine mm. doing it with fucking children and that. Mm. Cause it's depending on you, you know what I mean? I said, cause people depend on you. People, uh-huh. <laughs> You've got your responsibilities now, mate. You know, you're obviously your gym and your fucking cold water stuff and all. Uh, you're responsible for yourself, you know what I mean? Mm-hmm. It's like being a fucking... You need these up, but you go off the rails, mate. You're not responsible for yourself, mate. You don't even give a fuck about yourself. Nah, I mean, you're trying to be responsible for yourself. It's like looking after yourself again. I mean, it's like mothering yourself or fearing yourself. That's it, man. Scratch. You have got responsibility in a way when you're coming away for all that shit and trying to crop or stay away for it. That's a task in itself, nah, you know what I mean? Especially after, obviously, fucking, like, we've fucking been a mad gear heat and that. Uh, nah, things, nah, as nah, you nah. say, man, you're not giving a fuck. You're just like that. Nah, no nah. caring. See, even when I, see, if, like, I end up in the gear at the weekend there, so sometimes I still end up on it, you know what I mean? Even though I know all the nah, downfalls nah, I've nah. had with it. And it's, but I know all the pure that's like I'm fucking at like a pure lecture on it in myself. Aye, I want to know how to deal with it, right? If I'm getting aye, it, aye. right? Go to the gym, make sure you just force yourself into the gym, aye. do your fucking cold water, do that. It's like just pure damage, fucking reduction. Aye, I try and do now, man, but it is, it's like fucking risk assessments. That's exactly it, <laughs> mate. Doing a risk assessment on yourself, man. <laughs> but fucking, I fuck, I was going to say that. I was talking about that. I fucking lost my train of thought. I cause when, when you're on a gear, see, talk about why like, you don't give a fuck, cause that's when I take a gear, I'm a mad gear, he'd, see, I've obviously, I've not got a problem with gear, I can fucking take it or leave it, I don't uh, fucking yeah, ding yeah, me, but she yeah, wants yeah. I'm on it, that's I'm fucking uh, on it, I own it and it's when I want to go wild, and that's, I'm like, and I couldn't, uh, when the party's dying down, I've got to go to the home, I'll try and get a bit of gear and get uh, home, because yeah, I can't stand getting home and sitting uh, yeah, wired, yeah. awake and hitting a come down, so I'm like, I'll just uh, try and avoid it, uh, uh, and then before you know it, I'm sitting in the gaff, sniffing gear, with the curtain shut, and I fucking grab the half boat, getting mere gear dropped uh, off, uh, patched uh, work the next day, well, obviously the last time uh, we did the podcast, we met the day on the Thursday, uh, I had a funeral on the Tuesday, uh, and then I went home, I ended up fucking on it, the funeral, I ended up getting a bit of gear, and I went home, I was obviously trying to go out and all that shit, but naked was going out, so I ended up just sitting uh, uh, sniffing, uh, and then the next day, patched work, and then it was the Wednesday and I'm just sitting and I'm like, ah, right, I've fucked it anyway, so I'm no point in, no point in stopping. Uh, and it was yeah. getting like Wednesday night, man, I was like, ah, what the fuck have I, it's just a point I was sniffing, I was like, what the fuck am I doing, man? Uh, and it's like, as I say, it fucked us for the next day and all that shit and it just fucked uh, my full week, man. Pure, just, it fucks shit. that it's getting no good. We were just talking about earlier, me and Matt. So obviously Matt ended up on the weekend, he's still got a bit, must have come down the now. Uh, uh, is it fuck mate it's no good at all mate because as we go back to green and all that shit and you put down green like I could smoke a joint I'll pick up the guitar if I smoke a joint yeah, and I'll yeah, probably yeah. know all the time I'll write something but I'll come up I'll think of something I'll always create something yeah, I'll always yeah. try and get something to it master of gear yeah, I'm yeah. no doing fuck all I'm putting yeah, on a tune or I'm talking shit or I'm hitting a lot of you're shit you're even listening to music all the time you're on gear and all mate you just put tunes on it's like fucking you're constantly changing it, man. You never let it finish. Ah, yeah, you, know? so, like, you, you fuck me. You don't listen. You're not listening to it, man. You don't take it in no gear. But you think you're doing. It's just like that. It's all fucking. It's just as pure lies you feed yourself. I think the whole time, mate. It is, mate. It's mm-hmm. pure lies and delusion. I know. And see, sometimes the next day, you're, you're, everything's a pure great idea. You pure have these fucking obviously these mad worldwide fucking. It's like fucking uh, sitting at night and you think these brilliant ideas. Then you fucking next day, you're like, what the fuck was I think, man? I'm a fucking roaster. Just <laughs> oh, slaughtering nice. yourself. Here you come down. Like, I'm a fucking pure man. <laughs> Yeah, like, fucking, it's mad mate, all that shit, fucking, I, you see, talking about it, I know sometimes, man, it can pure sense, you do rally again, you know what I mean, talking about it, ah, it makes you think, fucking, that's mad mate, eh? It's a crazy fucking, yeah. it's a hell of a drug, yeah, as they say, me. hell being the fucking, the prime word there, man. Yeah, it's mate, every cunt's on it, oh man, every cunt. It's everywhere you go, mate, it's yeah. everywhere you go, it's yeah. like, you want to fucking, well, go on to try and keep us, you no know, sticking the cunt in, but we were in here on the Friday night, we came in today, like a wee sound check, just all that shit, and there was boys in the next room rehearsing that shit. Well, I, I jump in, see, all right, chat the door, walked in, walked in two seconds, and I nearly had a fucking note in my nose. Yeah, you know what, yeah, man? Yeah, yeah, also, yeah. the guy was just been brand new off of the line, but it was one of the ones you're like, ah, fucking hell, yeah. it's like, you can't yeah, even just I come know. to the studio and all that, it's fucking. Know. Back in the day, it was cups of tea, cunts offered, you know what I mean? I know. Yeah, <laughs> a cup of tea, mate, it was like, what a fucking right, line, line. sugar, man. <laughs> Fuck's sake. It's fucking... What a fucking patsy, many grams, yeah, you want, you know what I mean? Milk and two swedgers. Aye. But I obviously, I see obviously but back in like the fucking your head, obviously you were coming after gear and that, so see when you were fucking quite bad, mate, how was like the music, was that fucking just yeah, gone? Gone, mate, and gone. That was, was it just gone, gone or you just like, fuck that? I used to be the creative, mate, mate, making good tunes, constant flows, mate, I became, I just put myself on this fucking like routine where it was like, I've written a rope, it sounded the same, you know what I mean? But I kept doing it and doing it, somewhere I would start forgetting, I wouldn't, I used to have a good vocabulary and all that, mate, I used to be dead well spoken and all, it's, it's, I mean, that's what I'm saying, it's like some sort of brain damage, you don't know what I mean, I used to be dead intricate and fucking focused, deep and dead articulate, I could put everything towards dead easy, I still struggle with not to be, a candidate today, do you know what I mean, I don't think we have an ADHD and all that and doing all that and they'd send myself into, I did fucking, one of the main, one of the main factors where I had to stop 
was when I was slightly up all right with about one of my pals. Sniffing constantly, right? And we just sat down, it was the morning, but the birds are coming, fucking, obviously the sun's coming up and that. And I'm sitting saying to him, eh, fucking, this is all just a lie. See when you see the sun coming up and people panic, it's all in your head and all that. So I'm getting pure deep about it and that was all gear, they're sitting, it's just us two. It's like, we we'll smoke a joint, so we smoked a joint, you're full of gear. Fucking legs started going dead tight, and I'm like, man, I'm starting to no feel right, you know what I mean? I'll be staring, I started having like, or I thought like a schizophrenic, like psychotic episode, where I could see my own face, and like I was getting running, but like, I can run the room, and all that, oh, mate, and I was lying it. in bed, and I'm fucking, I was lost out of tears, and all that. I, I was starting to fuck me, it was all dizzy, and all that, for fuck. The boy doing the stairs, he was doing the stair, man, I heard a crash, right through the fucking, see the, the table, and the fucking little telly thing, yeah. right through it, man, with the heat, fucking right through the collapse, collapse, they collapsed, eh? Yeah. I was like, I'm panicking even more, I'm pure fucking shaking, stunned my boxes at like the top of the stairs. And he comes in, he's like, his he fucking nose is blood coming out it and all that. And he's like, I've just fucking fainted. And he looked at his man and just fucking again, right in the hall, man. Just missed the fucking corner of the tables in the hall. Like, mate, it was, mate, it was actually, I was trembling and all that. Do you know what I mean? He was the same. It's something We'd done something to ourselves, you know what I mean? Two of us had up your fucking meg. It was like a mental breakdown, mate. Wine goes. That, that changed me. That, that's when I, that's when I realised. My, even my speech and all that, mate, everything was all different after that. Like a proper mental breakdown, mate, it was mental, it was just mad, mate. They can't put the can up to, up the stair, my wee lass and that, and the brains were in and all that. They were setting him up to my wee lass's bed, and he's like, my head all right, and he's this big fucking bowling boy, a lump on his head, mate, and I shouldn't have, I mean, I was like, ah, it's fine, mate, go to sleep and all that. Shouldn't have done something like that, do you know what I mean? Aye. But I'm that fucking, oh, do wally, and pure, you don't oh, know, mate, you're trying to deal with yourself, yeah, it's I, could hear, I was hearing voices and all that, mate, it was actually like, fucking, it was a good fucking day. Mate, I've, there's, mate, there's a good few times that have sent me after the after deals. I, I ended up going to Newcastle one time and fucking woke up in Belfast, you know what I mean, mate? Fuck off, yeah, really? I mean, How'd that happen? Like, three days I've been on it, mate, just pure, that's why Steve, I've been up for days and I take it, mate, I start going psychotic. Like, start you fucking hanging things and trying to turn cunts against cunts and all that. Aye. Pure mental, mate, I turned pure nasty. And, uh, so my family and that was fucking... We were there, mate, and fucking, uh, I was just pure, after, the, the, the second day, the Saturday over there, I ended up going up after the proper half of the house, I we slept still, went to bought bus tickets, uh, sat for a good four hours, fully it, the bus, the, uh, the bus, and then before the bus came, I was like, ah, fuck it, but I back, and I started sniffing on us again, we got back drinking all again, Aye. then I went, I started going out nasty, t- I fucking pure weird, mate, a pure weird way, and uh, the, the next, the, next the, the Sunday, obviously, we were going home on the, it was the month, I think we were going home on the Sunday, and uh, we're in the train station, and there's uh, my, my pals is there, and uh, my missus and all that. And uh, I'm like, I see her, her brain that was there, her brain law. And I'm like, I see he's talking about you and all that, he's fucking saying stuff and all that, trying to turn cuts against you. So while that was all happening in the train station, mate, I picked my suitcase up and marched out the door, mate, and left it all behind. No money, no nothing, mate, not, I, had, I had a tenner, you know what I mean? And uh, <coughs> I bought the wine, and they uh, fucking went out in the wall, mate. Three days no sleep, you know what I mean? I sat in the wall, and they were all way in the train, mate, fucking. Phones out of battery, had my charger in a suitcase and that. Uh, sat in a wall, just stared at the gun, turning my wine for about two, three hours or something. Then I walked into a restaurant and uh, all these like, five star restaurant thing, like, can't see anything. There's me walking in my suitcase, big yellow jacket on, you know what I mean? Aye. Brazen, jumped there to see the bar and all that, jumped there the counter and all that, see their scampi fry rack. Like, I was like, I'm here to rob it and all that. So it was, I took the scampi fries after the fucking rack and that. <laughs> There's me running in this restaurant, fucking open the board and back to Chris and all that. Fucking, <laughs> okay, I was at my bin, mate, and I was like, I'm fucking, I'm, I'm lost and all that. Fucking, so they get the man, they, 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 they kicked me up, mate, they got me, they got me, like, I, I sit me down and put a, my, char- like, my charge, my phone and all that. I obviously yeah, realised you were fucking. fucking can I wait, so man? I phoned my uncle. Hey, I was like, my uncle, my, I've not heard this on my uncle for a good fucking 13, 14 years. He's in Belfast. I'm like, I need your help. I'm in trouble and all that. Uh, like, I'm fucking, I've, I've, I've fucking, I've done something, uncle. I, I, need to, I need you to get me away. You know what I mean? He's like, I'll get you, I'll get you a plane and all that for fucking Newcastle. So there's me and I got a taxi at the tenor, mate, so I had to get the taxi right and he's booked the plane. So it was, you don't need your fucking passport and all that. Ah, because it's, it's still it's, within the UK. Yeah, you just need your fucking, like, you get sort of the your phone and So I'm telling a taxi driver, I've just robbed, I've just robbed a restaurant and all that, you need to go. And he's like, ah, he's, 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 he's bolting at me, I'm going, go, 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 we need to go to the room. <laughs> and he's fucking, um, he's they fucking, we go, to, we go to the airport and he's like, what did you take? And I was like, oh, scampi fries. <laughs> 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 he's like, no, fuck it. He was like, he's always easy accent. He's like, I can't, he just couldn't believe it, mate. I was fucking, he was just, was he laughing? I, I was, busted I laughing, mate. Just, he just, they couldn't <laughs> believe it. And then, uh, mate, I fucking, I'd ran, I obviously ran out of gear and all that, mate. The only thing I had in my pocket was uh, the poppers, mate. You know what I mean? That was, oh, mate, it made you feel you got a little bit So that was it, that's what I did on to, mate. I was like, fucking do wally, mate. I'm in the airport. I'm getting through all this. I went to go to the suitcase, but they tell you it's more to take money to take your suitcase on. So I had all my Nike Air Max, a Rolex, and all that was in the suitcase and everything, mate. And I'm like, ah, just take it, just take it, and fuck it. You know what I mean? Just ditched it all, mate. Just fucking like that, patch it, man. Fuck the, fuck the su
So um, I took my four cans, I had four cans in the suitcase, so I took them and you could fuck it out to the air, out the front of the airport, started tarring them and all. You Fuck's know what I mean? Sake, man. Nah, you mate, fucking had the, the poppers and see you're going through and you're putting shit through the whole thing and they check everything that goes through ah, the last like So there's me and I've, the got, I've got the poppers in there and I'm like, ah, oh, it's a glass, it's glass, you know what I mean? And I'm like, oh, I bastard. I was like, I thought I'd do you know what I do, you know what I mean? So you're fucking running out of the bin, but the bin's a metal bin. So see when I'm flinging it in the bin, mate, it makes a big clanging noise in the airport, mate. I'm like, pure paranoid, like sweaty paranoid. And look at every cunt, I made it, I made it, made it look worse, you know what I mean? As I thought, they were flinging that bin there and all that. I thought I was going to get swarmed and that. Pure paranoid. I was on the plane and all, mate. We go on the plane. I hate planes, right? Don't fly, but I was in my fucking bin, right? And next to this old cunt, he's for he's Belfast, right? Uh, flying there, and I'm like, the woman's, you know, they're talking all that stuff, right? It's talking about fucking, uh, like, are you dead, Peter Massey and all that? Oh, and I'm at my bin, and I put my horn up. I says, see if this plane goes down, we're all pan breed, uh, pan breed and all that. The kid's next to me, he's got don't, son. He's got, he's, he's an accent, all that, but he's got don't. And she's, she's like, active me, all that, doing all this and all that. I've got deaf old pan breed and all that. Look at every cunt pan breed. <laughs> I was actually fucking wild, mate. Never did, nothing ever came. But the, the old cunt's next to me, somebody's like, where are you going? I'm like, I'm going to Ireland. And he goes, Northern Ireland. And I goes, no, I've got Ireland. And he goes, no, he was getting angry, mate. He was going, it's Northern Ireland. And he was fucking getting angry at me. Oh, really, eh? Because he's the fucking, he's built a term that was Northern ah, Ireland. Ah, obviously, they die staunch with that, mate. I was just, I was being a wee fan, you know what I mean, mate? And I go, I go to the airport, landed, Monko's there. See him walking in, man, he's off 13 years, and I'm like, yeah, he's fucking screaming and all that. And he just looked at his up your dr- 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 face, man, there's me with my fucking cracker. You know what I mean? <laughs> they ended up in better, mate, fucked me. That was a deal for me, he took me his missus gaff. They were trying to eat, man, I'm trying to eat, and I'm falling asleep, they took me home. That way, see, the time I go to a bed, mate, I was just trembling, like, first freaking and all that. Ah, even just did. completely Fell fucked. Asleep. Woke up, woke up the next day, and I'm like, ah. Fuck, do you know what I mean? Fuck, what am oh, I doing? I'm in fucking Belfast with no ne- money, no ne- paper, no ne- fucking nut, no ne- clays, no ne- nothing, mate. Like, literally fucking in Belfast. And I was like, Fuck's sake, oh, man, who's it come down like, yeah? Fuck off, mate. I had to spend a week there because I knew what I'd caused it all back when came, so I'm like, I let it all settle. And I had to stay there, mate. I just fucking sat on his couch. All I did was eat, see, like Mexicana cheese, spicy cheese, mate. Aye. I could grill one of the good grills, so it was like a spicy cheese, and I'd, I'd hate that for like breakfast, lunch, and dinner, mate, for about a week solid, mate. That was all Aye, that's why you could stomach, routine. man. I had a routine, I wrote a fucking wrote a tune and all that there. I got any more music and that a bit, mate, because I, 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 I took myself away from everything. I've not had that chance before. Aye, because they're there, because it's fucking, plus, it's hard to get fucking gear in that air there and on. Plus, I know you're away, you'll be your uncle, and that's just because if you know kids to get it, man. Aye. So I think it's probably did maybe benefit the degree actually benefit, going there. It did benefit me, it was good, because I go to catch up my uncle, not, do you know what I mean? But he took all the drink out the living room and all that. <laughs> like, like, oh, I got that away for you, fucking for crowd right. him for doing that, know what I mean? Right, but he fucking, it was good, mate. It was fucking, I just played the, his PlayStation and all that, you know what I mean? But I never really had much to do, you know what I mean? But he go, can't really go anywhere, do you know what I mean? Aye, I can name money on that, no, that fucking can I? How did they feel, obviously, seeing you woke up the next day? I've not seen him in 13 years, they don't feel a bit fucking, did you in contact him? Or did you feel a bit awkward or Aye, something? Like we spoke to him again through the years, but no, no too much and all that. Aye. Last time I saw him, he was going to, I think he was going to Iraq, that was the last time it was fucking, I was away, do you know what I mean? It was like 2000. But he was in the army. Oh, so Aye, any worries, mate, don't worry about it at all, man. Aye, any sweat, bro. Aye, yeah. Bye, fuck, mate. 2003, I think, or something, 2002, or something. I can't remember when I was, I was a wee guy when I last saw him, do you know what I mean? Fucking mm-hmm. a wee guy, so it was med, med, mental, mate. But when I saw him, it was good to catch up and all that, do you know what I mean? Nah, it was the one that probably a positive to come yeah. out of it. I mean, you know, all the people, you know what I mean? All the family that's about you, he's the one that, you know what I mean? Saved my ass, took paid, paid the flight. I know, that's the see, because think about it, because as you say, if you'd known much contact with him, hadn't seen him in years, man, and you right. phoned him, like, ah, listen, I bothered, mate, I can't say, but I just put the phone down, you know what I mean? Yeah, Proud yeah, of yeah. me, actually, fucking went yeah. like, I'll get you fucking air here, man. Right. But he's, he's, he's fucking, do you know what I mean? It's good that's. I mean, it's a good cunt, you know I mean? It's family ah. business. Some blood doesn't mean everything, but you know what I mean? But it's been some cunt does step up to it, you know what I mean? If they're, when they're there for you, that's ah. fucking real, do you know what I mean? Ah, death was, mate. You can't buy all, that shit, man. My papa, I know. But his dad, you know what I mean? He fucking, he was there, he got me back and all that. Oh, did he, aye? Yeah, he was always you know, phoning every day, making sure everything was all right, you know? He always does that. That's just phoning me, my papa. Oh, is <laughs> that, aye? Twice, uh, <laughs> I just make sure you're good. Yeah, I just want to see what's happening, so- I just, did they hang me? So see when you were obviously in Belfast, how did you end up letting everybody back came? Did, did, did I take it to the uncle tell them, listen, I've got the yeah. bulge in here? Right, I, no, I told every cunt all that. My missus, uh, 
three messages there's another one I was away and she's like I got something to tell you and all man you're pregnant I was right she was fucking pregnant fuck's sake yeah, so is that your D your aye, youngest then fucking hell man what a fucking roller coaster that is fuck's sake the next day we got the next fucking day fucking hell man what were you like your next day like that what the fuck man just fucking I feel like that I'm listening to this I'm listening to this and I'm like what the fuck man I'm feeling fucking it was on the FaceTime and she's like I'm like you're pregnant and fucking just I'm getting that up Fuck's sake, take man. It in. I'm phoning her, but I was still paranoid now. So I'm at her, I was like, fucking eh, pack all the stuff in the house, get everything in the suitcase. He's been all the clay, he's been everything. We're leaving, I'm coming back, we're taking everything, we're gone, we're leaving and all that, we're never coming back. Now. <laughs> she's, so she's actually packing everything and all that, getting rid of everything, trying to, try to sell the telly and all that. Is she, eh? She was like, fuck, I was determined, I was like, fucking going to do why. Well, fucking, once it obviously comes in my shit back again, get back and it was all back to normal. In the cupboard, man, I'm like, where's my clays? She has put been all the old clays, mate. She bent all my new clays and left all my old ones. Oh, I'm like, what? All my trainers, not I'm like, what the fuck? You know what I mean? Fuck's okay, sake, but, man. Oh, it was bad, mate. Bent all my good clays, man. I've had fucking some of my best clays that I pure kept good for years, mate. Never worn all that. She bent it. Oh, but the pure best, I said, your pure favourite clays. She bent all the old stuff, but she would know, do you know what I mean? She bent all the fucking good stuff and left all the old stuff. Oh, that man. Start for scratch, man. Fuck's sake, man. That's a fucking, that's a pure heavy fucking, yeah, the worst icing on the cake yeah. ever, innit, man? It must have been the worst month in my Life, man. Fuck's sake, it sounds like a fucking roller coaster. So you listen yeah, to that, man. Yeah, yeah. So, how was it when you get back? Obviously, with shit with family, I take it, shit was tense as fuck. Yeah, that. It's tense as fuck. My mom's my mom, my mom's, my mom's boyfriend, and that I had a, a phone call with him and all that. Me when I was away, because I was trying to make them everybody help her fucking pack the house and all that. And I was, I was, I was just fucking expecting everything to jump to me, do you know what I mean? Mm-hmm. And the way I was fucking erratic, still my brains were the shot, fell out with them and all that, fell out with everybody, you know what I mean? Kind of, it was a kind of. Put myself in a corner, do you know what I mean? Aye, ah, I just kind of isolated yeah. for every cunt and just they went like. I understood why I done it or why I still don't even have, really understand why, do you know what I mean? I don't understand still. Cunts always go with the Jadera, like, I fucking don't know why, you know what I mean? I don't know how it happened. It's you know a gear, mate, it's a gear, it does that, mate. Even like yeah. it's like, it just it makes you just fucking turn against every cunt yeah, and just does, put yourself, yeah. with, isolate yourself and shit yeah. like that, you know what I mean? Yeah, That's yeah, how yeah. people, like, like you say, I've done it, I know, mate, with a gear, I've met a cunt, I've fell out with. So I've fucking, I've kind of squared a lot of it, but there's still a lot of cunts that's. Stone still left no one turn, left no turn, no. I mean, and yeah, it is, yeah, yeah. it's like, yeah, it's just what it does, man. You just get in this mad fucking paranoid, fucked up yeah, state yeah, of mind, yeah. man, and you come out it and you're like, whoa, that, yeah, was, that wasn't me. Horrible. So, was that the kind of, like, the kind of turning point? You're like, alright, I need to fucking get this yeah, shit together. Yeah, that was, well, that was the most, that was the turning point. I think that's where I don't see the, the one of the freestyles I've got, and it's fucking on the 1250. Mm-hmm. It's the jumper with the orange slides, so if you've ever seen that, Aye. I that in. Uh, is that the one you wrote in Belfast? It's about drugs and all that, that one, that's about fucking, I'm done mate, do you know what I mean, I'm done with all that shit. But that's them, but I'd lost a lot of weight mate, I was fucking, maybe 11 stone and all that, you see him with the red t-shirt and all that one, with aye. The that, but I was fucking skinny then. Aye, you were quite that, slim, aye, but you were just dead young, you know what I mean, aye, that's I was, what I thought. I was young then mate, but fucking, lost more weight than that. that so you were skinny, mate, aye, fuck's sake. Year, mate, was, there was a member at David Lloyd gym, the... Uh, See, after I'm taking you all the time, that was one of the boys, and we're like, I stood in the scales, mate, and I was doing a 10 stone fucking, but 10 stone 9, mate, I've never, I was like that when I was fucking 13 or something, man. Fuck's sake, like, man. Oh, fuck, this isn't right, and I didn't even go to, didn't even do exercise or nothing like that, I was pure, sitting there pure fuck, like, what's going on here? Right, you start thinking, oh, like, I've got cancer, or I've got something around me or not, but you know what I knew what it was, you know what I mean? You, yeah. get, you go, fuck, fuck. You're just, you're know, telling you know, it's, you know, it's everything you know, else apart from the gear, yeah, it's yeah, everything but the gear, the gear yeah, isn't the problem, there's something else. Panic, mate. You, it's just because you don't eat and all that, you, you own that stuff, and the, uh, Fucking obviously when I came out for a year the last year, mate, since it's locked in, mate. Fucking drink all the time, mate. Again, three stone, know what I mean? Fucking f- 14 stone now. Mm-hmm. That's fucking one year done that. Three stone in one year for bevying and all that, but it's fucking overeating and all. But fuck, mate, it's not mad, isn't it? Fucking up and doing, up and doing. It is, it's crazy, man. Yeah. It's fucking is. It's a pure roller coaster, but it sounds it. So see, obviously, that was your kind of turn. So that was just recently then, the stuff that fucking made Newcastle and Belfast now. Yeah, well, it was only like fucking just uh, about two years ago now. Like two, was it, About a year ago, aye. So was that the last time you were on the gear? Have you been able oh, to keep... I've been on it since, so obviously. Uh, so it's just, the, but the odd time, mate. but it's no like, fucking no, as bad as... still battled it, know what I mean? It still was always there. It would always be like, you, t- you think about the gear and you think... Oh, it sounds good, do you know what I mean? It's that feeling, but then you're forgetting about all the other things after that. You never think about that. It's that like, you're only everybody's you're, you're wired to, to want pleasure, do you know what I mean? You never think of the bad stuff all the time. Mm. It's your brain that plays tricks on you because I'm yeah. listening to that man and no, I'm hearing them like that. Ah, fuck's sake. Yeah. They're seeing you're saying I'm sniffing gear, I'm like that. Ah, fuck, sniffing yeah. gear. Then I'm like that. Ah, you're telling a story that's a pure horror story about <laughs> sniffing gear, and it's weird. It's like how the brain can just yeah. it's like it'll play, play tricks on you. Like, see, some kind of like, Let's say if you're in a party and some cunt whips a bit of gear out, your, your brain will be, you'll be fighting with your brain in order to take that and your brain will be replaying
it'll be giving you all the memories, all the good times you've had on the gear, yeah, and that'll yeah, be playing yeah. back. So, so and and you'll have that. See the minute the next day, a line or whatever day you stop, and the next day you get to come down, you'll yeah. think, this is why I don't take this. Yeah, and you've got all the times you felt like this. Like, why yeah. could I, how could my brain not think of this? Yeah. And it's yeah. always the same. Yeah, and it's same like, I think it's like an addict's brain as well. So when you've been bad with it, man, it's like, you've got a kind of different type of brain, man. It's like weird. It's like it's got a fucking... Almost a fuck, not, mm. a, not a whole to a degree, but almost right. it's like that kind of fucking way, man. Right. It's like it's left a fucking sort of kind of imprint, know yeah, what I mean? Yeah, yeah, it is, I know. Is it ever so fucking when you're baby, man? Everybody's done it with your baby and you start wiping the toilet, and that's when you start praying, man. As soon as you hit that toilet, wiping, you're like, oh, please, I'm not drinking again. I don't ah, get it again. Aye, mate. You know, this is the last time, you know. Never. Like, everybody does it all the time, mate. You don't remember all these things, though, I mean, you just. It's the pleasure parts you always think about. If it's always pleasure. Ah, uh, it's just that wee short term dopamine hit. It's just that wee right. I can change my mood. The new I could probably elevate this up right now. You might not be feeling shit, but it'll be like I will feel better. Yeah. And I can do it a click of a finger. Yeah, when they talk about the fucking internet, every religious book, me, the Bible especially, you know what I mean? They talk about temptation. The temptation's the devil, you know what I mean? The temptation's one of that. See, when you stop, you stop smoking, stop doing anything. That wee split moment where you go, I fuck, you do it. It's a temptation. I mean, you're getting into temptation. Right? Anything does tempt. If, you have to, if something has to tempt a human being, and that whatever it is, it's tempting you, isn't it right? You know, it's a bad thing. Uh, you have to be tempted into things. 100%. Temptation is fucking dangerous. It's true as fuck, mate, because you think about it. It's, it should really all come down to free choice. You should be doing something because you yeah. truly want to do it, no? Yeah, because. It should be an effect. It should be a. A question and uh, if something's good for you, you don't ever question it. Know what I mean? Never question it. It's good for you. But if you're having to question something all the time, or you know that's classed as temptations. You know what I mean? Temptations. It's spoke about for thousands of years. Tempta- temptation is the devil, mate. It's no like can't think the devil with big horns and fiery pits of hell and all that. The devil is temptation. It's still us. It's human beings are two people. Do you know what I mean? We're all two people. Nah, you're fucking you're yin and you're yang. You know your basic needs. You know what I mean? When you get your basic needs, your food, food, water, and a place to sleep. Do you know what I mean? And then everything after that's it's not. It's different. Know what I mean? No, it's no guts. There's two versions of humans, you know what I mean? There's, there's the program, and then there's everything else outside the program, do you know what I mean? Aye. It's mad, it's fucking... 100%, man, I do. I totally agree with that. See, with the t- temptations of the devil and that kind of thing, as it is, it does. Mm-hmm. And see, when you look at all these things, it, the, the temptation, it does, it brings it the worst in you. Like, see, you get people, I don't know. Maybe not what the likes says, but you get people to right. steal, you know, it's like a temptation you know, getting up there. You can t- get the one that live and leads to the one that's always for one thing in it in the end, isn't it? Agreed, they're sucking the selfishness, mm-hmm. it always goes back to that kind of if you mm-hmm. boil it back to it. Mm-hmm. But see, obviously, like, when you were starting, have you ever tried going to like, any kind of cooking anonymous meetings? Have you ever no, tried it like no, that? No, 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 I, mean, I never ever thought about it. It's obviously pondered looking at it and all that, but you're like, ah. It's, the, it's all me, you know what I mean? At the end of the day, it's your face. I've got thought about it, but it's the lockdown there with the drink, mate. I was, I mean, I started really wanting to see the alcohol, it's anonymous, you know what I mean? But I stopped drinking mm-hmm. properly, have something to, like, like group power kind of thing, do you know what I mean? But there's no way everyone was that lockdown, mate. So I had to battle that shit myself, you know what I mean? Right. And it's still, it's still to this day, mate, it's still hard, you know what I mean? I'm still fucking battling the baby the news, you know what I mean? It's, right. it's hard, mate, because you see, see what I realised. I used to always think, man, I'm like, ah, see, I was always like, ah, how do people end up fucking alcoholics? I'm like, ah, see, you got your like, drinking, I'm like, how do you do that mm-hmm. every day? But see, during the lockdown, mm-hmm. I was going out in the bikes, it was sunny and all that shit. Mm-hmm. Right, a few of the boys like, ah, fuck it, get a wee beer, and all that, that's mm-hmm. dynamite. Mm-hmm. And the next day out in the bikes, I fuck it, a wee beer for you, mm-hmm. know what? If you drink every day that week, and then you you're going out in the bike, and see, you going back to that thing. It's your brain's programmed to do this, so yeah. I'm going out in the bike like that. And I want a beer, and I'm like, no, and I'm like, right, this can just get a fucking yeah. get out of hand quite quickly. It can, it's, it's a habit, mate, it's a habit sort of time. So saying that you fucking. Then if you were to go cycling two times without taking a beer, then you were the third time you went, you wouldn't really think about a beer anymore. It's just a constant habit. It's it would just need to take A two times, but A two mm. times is it's fucking, it's hard, man. And mm. I, I'm saying that. But I'm comparing it to see the likes of some people that's maybe done it for months or years. Yeah, I've yeah, done it yeah. like a couple of weeks and I found yeah. it hard. Not. I could only imagine if he's saw somebody that's been done it for a while yeah, as part yeah, of the routine. Yeah. Plus as well, you're sitting chilling, up, going out on the bike. Maybe we know every day I went out on the bike. But see, yeah, if you're yeah. sitting down at night watching the telly and you open a wee beer, you're yeah, going to sit down most, you know, every night watching the telly. Yeah, yeah. That's going to uh, sit down. You're going to be watch, sitting there watching the telly most days of your life. Yeah, yeah, so it's like, no, I mean, that's going to be part of your fucking your, uh, routine. routine. Yeah, yeah, it's that, right. Once it's into your routine, that's when it's... I suppose the habit, the fucking uh, the dependency yeah, comes into it. It is, mate, I know. But it's fucking, when I was doing a date, mate, it's always night time, you know what I mean? It's, I can go through the day, do you know what I mean? I always never, I always get through the day no matter what, even if I was drinking every night, you know what I mean? But through the day, it's night time, mate, I'm scared of, sometimes I've been that lonely, way. Where you don't, I've, see if I've no, I've, I've stopped myself with doing it, I'm sitting there, I, I get, I panic a wee bit, mate, and I'm panicky. Like, what do I date, what do you date night now, what do you, like, you forget, what you forget what there is, there's like, Games don't satisfy you playing the Xbox and all that. You start to panic, mate. So I, I started associating, same thing I've done with the gear, associate my music 
with drugs and the drink. So I'd go, oh, okay, I'll, I'll take a patsy and I'll put my headphones in and I'll write a tune. Aye. It became my routine. So I, was, I wouldn't touch it when I write any other time now. So I try and write everything I was on gear. So when I drink, I, but, I, but I have wrote tunes and I've been drinking. You know what I mean? But I go, I'll have a drink and I'll write a tune. And it's, I'll just get in it. So it's a wee lie I tell myself. Like, I'll, I'll fucking, I'll just get a baby and I'll write a good tune. But I never write. Half the time I'm sitting there, I start listening to the other instruments wrapping away and your eyes are off fucking shit. Right? Like, <laughs> you're like, you're fucking singing mad. away. Or you start messaging kids like, like bro, I love you. You know what I mean? We'll go camping, we'll go we'll go and do that. Like, that's what happens all the time, but you feed yourself a lot of sweet, sweet lies, isn't it? That's what it fucking is, mate. Nah, you could just sell on. I did it with the greens, you talk about I sit in the night tune, but I was just eating through a fucking pure state of mind where I'd be like, ah, ah, you know, I smoke green because it makes me creative and all that shit. So see if I wasn't stoned, I'd be like, ah, I've been staying off it, but oh, no, I smoke it, and then that's that would be my that's I'm, I'm benefiting us cunts that sit and smoke it every night. Uh, you know, yeah, they fuck all, but I'm sitting creating, so I've, I'm justifying it yourself. Uh, yeah, you're just bullshit. Uh, and as you see, I'd smoke it and end up fucking getting a munch, sitting watching shit, uh, and yeah. then I'd be sitting no day fuck all. Uh, and yeah, that's yeah. it, the, the way I'm on the loose because I'm off it. I'm sitting, part of my brain, I'm seeing I'm like, ah, right, I'll fucking do this and that, I'll write something and all that, uh, and then yeah. it's like a wee part of your brain. Ah, you're only fucking. You need a, a, a joint today. Ah, you need it. Need you need it. Ah, yeah. if you want good lyrics, you need to smoke a joint. And I'm like, no, it's no. That's I don't. a lie. A lot of people tell themselves that like, it all comes from. It like, stems from when I was back young with Bob Marley and all that. You think, oh, it's because you smoke weed and all that's how they make all these. I mean, it's no. Weed, people always use these as fucking excuses all the time. You know what I mean? I think they need things to be. If you've got that in you today, you can. It's in you. Do you know what I mean? Aye. You ever done? You ever something? Sometimes I've. I don't. I can't freestyle, mate. And sometimes I'll put on a beat, mate. And freestyle, and you forget everybody, mate. You've done it for three minutes, and it's like the best tune you've ever made in your life. It would have been a hit number. I mean, it would have been the best tune anyone's ever heard. Never remember it. You know what I mean? And then sometimes when I go through a writer's block, mate, for months, I go, I oh, fucking, I start hanging. But then I remember back to the freestyles, and I think, fuck, I've got that in me. Do you know what I mean? I don't need pen and paper. I've got that in me somewhere. Do you know what I mean? I always, everybody's got it, and and if you can do it. Drunk, whatever, you know what I mean? <laughs> you can date sober, it's nah, in you, it's already in you. I feel you're, you're creative, you know what I mean? It's as if, let's see if you're, you're doing that, and maybe it might fucking spark another, like fucking put you in another state of mind, you nah, know, things differently. But I, because that's, I'm doing, you're talking about nah, the freestyle yeah. thing, I, well, obviously I was in the jail. And I wrote about two albums worth in the jail, and obviously in there I had nothing. Aye. I was no anything, and I didn't even puff at the time. So I'm like, ah, right, obviously I can do this. Can I, do I'm, it, cre- I'm creative. I can write this aye. shit. So it's no, aye. it's just on the heat. Aye. As it was, and it's like, aye, as you say, the brain. It's like goes back to the brain telling yourself when you see the gear. Out, like, oh, so be a good night if I take. I should be a shite night if I don't take that gear. Aye. But it's no. Aye. It's, aye. A, it's aye. a shite aye. night if you take it. Is it a ruined your night? The fucking shit. I can't mean. I don't think I've ever. Can't mean the last time I sat. Nah, mad went for a gear, and the next day I was like, ah. I'm glad I took you last night. Uh, hi, it no, doesn't no, happen. I've done it, mate. You spend my time with fucking feeling down about it, and then you did enjoying it. No, I mean, he might be. I might have enjoyed so fucking say twelve hours. I fucking been on it, mate. But you spend about fucking seven days a week. That after that, after that, feel depressed. Then it's need enjoyment. Nothing's enjoy. You start questioning things and all that. You start. You can't keep tap of stuff either. Uh, start yeah. panicking about things and all that. Worrying if oh, I've not done this for, I've not done that right, or something's no right and all that. You start pure. Oh, yeah, this shot makes no effort. Ah, uh, it's mate. It's like fucking I feel as if even you're half it and all that, man. You're uh, building life. You're building a big Jenga block. That's and it, then man. fucking playing a big game of a Jenga. Then see once you take a gear, that block uh, just yeah, hits the ground, and you need to build it back up, block by uh, block again. And it's like. And the worst thing is, I know it's even worse if you tick here, because see, once you get full of it and you're doing uh, a week yeah, come yeah, down, worst, see by the time that the fucking come down wears off, you need to pay some cunt, so uh, you're back in the depression. Like, Fuck's sake, I'm fucking doing money. Uh, yes, I, you know, I, tell you, I had to pay out fucking money today, man. It was fucking heartbreak, man. <laughs> so I've got my rent coming out today, and obviously I've just moved into a gaff, so I'm like, ah, it was what I was like, mate, because it was like eight quid a week, my rent. I'm like, ah, that's, I just paid for the gear. That was my, I could have uh, just paid yeah, my rent yeah, with that yeah, and had, yeah. had that. So it seemed you get that, and you're like, ah, uh, fucking dick. But date every single time, man, it's fucking brutal. It's a bad cycle, isn't it? But it's all for that wee tiny bit of pleasure, you know what I mean? I know, and, and pleasure, is it pleasure? The only nice pleasure so. is, the only pleasure you get is, you like, ah, fuck it, I'll take it. Then you, it's, I don't get mm-hmm. it. It's like, just, it's as if you get the pleasure for. I don't know, it's like you get a dopamine hit just yeah, by getting do- into it. It's a dopamine hit, doesn't it? Doesn't it? Pleasure, you don't know, music and talk all the conversations you have with cunts and all that. You, a lot of cunts will go, oh, what we talk about in the next day and they get off with a pure fear thinking about, oh, oh sorry, I oh, saw that was pure shit. I, mean, you, 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 get, says, I talk absolute yeah. awful. Yeah. Uh, that's it, mate. You don't. But at the time you're on it, you think, "Fucking, this is." You feel that's the whole point of taking it. It's you're just, you're just fucking, mm. you're just. It's just a dopamine hit. It's a hit. It's like fucking. There's no. It's no like a, a constant. Enjoyment, you know what I mean? It's like, nah, I know. It's once you get the pleasure, once as soon as you take it, the pleasure's there. 
But the, all that shit you think talking about it, you make feel good. Everything will feel good. Everything feels good on it. You know what I mean? But it doesn't feel good. It's it's just sort of a band. What felt good was that when you took it that time. You know what I mean? That's what's making you feel good. Aye. Talking about it doesn't make you feel good. All that that I mean, talk about talking shite, you cunts and all that. Aye. It's all a shite, mate. Because you're talking and all, we're saying fucking see once every kind of you're in the room, fucking getting on it, fucking getting on it, and you're yeah. knowing it. You're like, ah, these cunts are doing my Aye, fuck. That's when you realise. That's it. how you end. That's how I end up on it. Cause I'm like, I either Aye. need to get on these cunts' wavelength, or I'll get to fuck. Aye, get I, that's to my. Fuck. I can't sit here and try and talk to these cunts because. It's aye. like a pure, they're like fucking, it's like running a race with cunts that are on fucking, like I've got a lap in front aye, of you. Aye. You know what I mean? It's kind of pointless. Aye. You get peer pressure on all, man. Aye. You tell cunts something, you tell cunts you're off it, they laugh at you, it's like, it's like a joke. You know what I mean? And they like, just go for it, just date. It's just, it's just not. Just try to drag you down with them. It's only the, that's just the thing, cunts don't realise that, that it's not, a lot of times you need to remind yourself that the, the existence is real, you know what I mean? You've got one life. There's only so many years can you keep doing it for before you're an old man, do you know what I mean? I you're not going to make it, but keep doing that same shit, you know what I mean? Do that same life. Do that right up to your 40, man. You're not seeing 50, do you know what I mean? Nah, yeah, people, ha- fuck, people take life for granted all the time, mate. It's, it's not until you're in nighttime lying in your bed, that's when you realise everybody always does it. That's why night times, it's the same for every kind of night times when you really sit and go, fuck, right, existence, I mean, you think about life and what. Focus building big luxury, no one doing old towns to build mad luxury things and charge the other fucking odds for them and all that shit, man. Bad, mate. Let me just talk the old village and all that. You remember that in Limit, the old village? Is that the Tesco was there, see, before they built Tesco? I'm not too sure, I've not been through Limit in nah, five years. It was the old village, mate, but it was all that small, it was all that fucking common man businesses, you know what I mean? It was hundreds of them, hundreds of wee businesses and all that. And the funny, the Tesco had bought, bought it early on, it was like fucking 1990 something they bought it. They put the rent up in all the places and all that, mate, and fucking drove them out. So the Tesco's built new big corporations, know what I mean? And then they've got Greg's and all that doing a wee, wee shops. Where's the, the, the common man businesses, you know what I mean? Nah, it's all your fucking big massive fucking corporate man. And then everybody just thinks, well, that's work, you know what I mean? We've got work in these places for these people, you know what I mean? As if we need to work, we don't, humans don't need to work anymore. You know what I mean? That's <clears throat> why you see when you can't go to the brew and that, why do you think the brew give you money? It's compensation. It's because we have our basic rights, you know what I mean? You're just mate, you're born, <clears throat> you want to go build a house, can you? Some kind of owns the land. We're going to catch a fish, can't Some cunt owns it up. Nah, some cunt are there before you, man, aren't they? Nah, some cunt owns everything, everything's been owned, so it's compensation, but for the actual right to live exists, you know what I mean? To actually live a natural life has been taken off as by the governments and all that. So the, the money people get, the, the universal credit cunts get, that's compensation. That's why they can never really take it off you. No matter what, no matter what you've done, even if you don't, you don't do and you get sanctioned and all that, you still get it back somehow, you get hardship or you get something back for them, you know what I mean? Can't so they're fucking entitled, you know what I mean? It's no entitled, it's fucking compensation. Yeah, exactly. Everybody I mean, should be compensated for their life and their natural, I mean, their rights. Talk about human rights all the time, can't talk about human rights all the time, but we've been stuck for his birth, you know what I mean? For hundreds and hundreds of years, you know what I mean? It's fucking mental. Yeah. The Highland Clearances in Scotland, do you know what I mean about that? When the Highland Clearances after the Battle of Culloden, no. when English went up and had the Highland Clearances, had, had banned tartan, they banned, uh, banned tartan other things, mate. They fucking couldn't carry weapons, that's how Scottish people couldn't carry knives or swords and all that anymore. They w- and wiped all the island clearances out for sheep farms. Put see all the all the, all the houses up the north and that wiped them all out, burnt them all. Moved all the people into like Glasgow and all the towns and all the cities and all that and left that. I mean, oh really? Aye, 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 mate, aye, it's fucking. I aye. know it's, it goes back some fucking far back in time, man. It's been corrupt as fucking. The worst thing about it is it's the way you're made to feel as if you're lucky. But you're lucky we're giving you this, like your universal credit. Ah, no, yeah, you yeah. fucking count yourself lucky you're getting this and that. Yeah, like, yeah. We have a fucking minute here, not. I mean, like, what's even NHS is a. Like, call oh, a sponge in half NHS. We taxpayers, money, we pay for this shit. Yeah, 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 That's yeah, what it's yeah. like, we forget at the end of the day. Like, this government's yeah. meant to be working for us, no other way yeah. about. And the way yeah. it's corporation shit, it's with the Covid as well. It's like, what about a small business being shut down? All the corporate ones are just got to take care. See all these small uh, businesses that can't open up. That's uh, just going to get turned into something. That's the ones that's locked down. This is what they're saying about us. So people, a lot of people are saying the lockdown was all a day with financial stuff. It was all a day with crushing the small businesses. You know what I mean? If we can survive it. Can they survive it? They're all shutting down and all that. But the only ones that survive are the, the, I mean, like McDonald's, billionaire companies and all that, mate. Like, oh, they will never ever, they'll always survive. I mean, <laughs> even the anything, anything happens, mate. Pandemics, fucking fucking okay. i mean uh, it's recessions and all that mate they always come out on tap again they always they always, always end up mate. fucking better off mm, you know it's always the small businesses i mean i mean the, the common person aye, the common person's fucking business that always shut down in the end i mean nah, it's it's, 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 it's communism in a way mate Aye, no, I, I mean, see it's a day, it's, it's like blanket communism, you know what I mean, it's like fucking sleeping, it's like fucking slag. Slowly turning it into communism, do you know what I mean, it slowly is, can't even fuck all, mate, you know what I mean. It's, right, it's the way it's fucking is, mate, it is, it's fucking... Because it's just, plus and also, when you look at the pandemic, I think like the fucking, like the, the rich man percent, they've all fucking, they have doubled their wealth. I know, You know what I mean, yeah, all the fucking poor cunts have fucking end up worse off, it's always Aye. the same, the rich get richer and the poor get poorer. It's always the same, yeah. sometimes it's so, but... 
I'm not to be rich, mate. You can be rich in life, mate. That's what I am. That's what I believe, mate. But you've got to be rich in life. Aye, no, definitely. Just... If you see you wake up every day, mate, you're, you're, you're there, mate. You're healthy. Your veins are healthy. You know that's that's what makes me happy. You know what I mean? Like, that's all I needed. You know what I mean? But fucking everything after that, you feel forced into things a lot of times. Mm-hmm. You know what I, I mean? Definitely, it's like forced into see. Oh, it's impossible to see with your social media and that shit. You're constantly com- yeah, comparisons of deep joy. You know what I mean? Whereas yeah. you think if we didn't have this. But I could just go on a phone and I'm looking, I'm going to get news because you can never avoid it. You can unfollow shit, but it's going to pop up. It somehow pops up. It always does. It always finds its way onto your screen, no matter how much you avoid it, man. And it's some mad article written to fucking provoke outrage. It's some dick's opinion. You've seen this and that. And it's hard to. And it's one of them, you can crank him off social media, but you come off it and it's like you shut yourself off in the world. You become a recluse, man. I came off it for like a month or two. And there was shit happening. I felt it was if I was sitting my pals in conversation. They were like, as if. I was just, uh, as if I'd been fucking away for a fucking, I uh, went in our country or something, uh, man, since we were talking about shit. Yeah, that's where you get a lot of your news, cunts dying and all that, cunts fucking that's dear. That's I know, it's everything, it's obviously if it's no face, you're in group chats and all that, or cunts message, you know, it's all the time, mate, everybody, but fucking aye, it's all the time, I don't read the paper and all that, I don't think the paper's uh, going to be decent. Fucking oh shit, shit, man. Read the paper. Mm-hmm. Get cunts, it, it's get cunts, it still read the paper this day, it's like fucking, uh, that's a sauce you get, it's a few, it's like a lot of the older generation are like that. Uh, they take their news for the paper on BBC News and it's like it's honestly god they're like so, so different like these generations like other generations where we're a lot more clued up things with uh, the rising yeah, internet not we're a lot more information's there then. I mean the information's there you can fucking read something and then go and search so uh, these kids stay nowadays and they read it fact checks you know what I mean but the fucking yeah, you're fine, but if you, if they, if, I mean, if they, the big, the big cunts want you to know something, they'll know that you know something. I mean, if they want to hide something, they'll hide something. It's nah, their game, mate. That's their game, isn't it? It's their game. It's all their game. That's their world. Nah, that's the thing as well. Can, that, that fake news, not shit, because it's now they're starting to get with us. The internet, that was like your source you could go and find out, but now nah, they're starting to get fake articles. It's put out all the shit that's nah, put out yeah. there to spread misinformation nah, or kind of shit. It's put out to make it. A lot of cunts times it's just cunts want attention though. They make these fucking fake things up to get their attention on their pages and all that. Ah, clickbait and all that shit. I fucking hate clickbait so much. It does my fucking... YouTube one, see when the wee boys watching shit, man. It's like fucking... It's fucking grown men who rage. Talk about fucking... My girlfriend slept in my bed and all that shit. Like that, man, that boy's about my age and he's fucking... It's fucking he's making Wayne's programme. He's like, Wayne sings and that. Fuck me, I guess. It's a mad boy called Morgs or something like that. I think it is, man. Morgs? Morgs, his name is, mate. He's about fucking my age and he makes mad weird... That's one creepy videos on my... Like, he screams all the time and all that. I'm like, I get that. Cunt off, man. I get that. Fuck? Fucking cunt off my daily. He's weird, mate. He's weird about silly clickbaits and all that. Mad weird videos. My wee boys feel right into it. I'm like, ah, fuck, you're going to melt your brain watching that. That's the thing as well. See, YouTube was, when we were doing it, we had this channel 25 or whatever. Fucking, uh, it was, it was got a choice. They didn't have a choice, but now yeah, they can go on YouTube. It back then, days, but our days, man, we were out fucking, they didn't have, remember phones, man? It was like, these, they were obviously the wee Nokis, then it was their. The Sony Ericsson's, the yeah, fucking, the Walkman, remember the Sony Ericsson Walkman? Then it was the Samsung Slide phone. Ah, like Samsung D500. Then it was never the fucking, like the first touch screen good phone. It was that LG cookie or something like that, wasn't it, man? And I'd fucking. Was it the one when, you, remember the first one you could do a video call? It was a fucking brick and you flipped it up yeah. and all that, and then it had the, you could video call. Yeah. Remember a video call my granny? And it was like, you're talking to some cunt in the lap. <laughs> and it's like pure broken fucking pixels and all that shit, it was fucking shite, right, man. But that was it, that was what it was like, there was no Facebook, and that's how you used to scheme fight, you didn't, you didn't know all these cunts, feel like, they weren't they, see nowadays wee boys, man, wee boys are hanging about with, let's like, say one scheme, hanging about with they're hanging about with boys for that scheme. I mean, Facebook's made every kind of social at the same time, mm. it's connected people, you can't. We used to fight other boys for their skins, they'd be like, oh, there was myths about these guys, there was a story, or he's a bad one, and it's just, you don't ever really go face value yet, you don't know how he really looks in ah, person. Ah, you had this that. just image, but yeah, up your head, so, and it was just for your imagination, yeah, plus the shit you turned, and obviously Chinese yeah, whispers, yeah, like, yeah, some yeah. cunt farts, and by the time it gets to you, it's been a tornado yeah, or some shit like that, you know what I mean? That's why, I think that's why Scottish cunts were in the gang fighting for a long time, obviously, because, wasn't it long ago, with the fucking, a the, lot the, the kind of the, it's Highlands and all that. No, I mean, no, Highlands are clans. We had clan mentality. So they're always God battling each other. They're always battling each other. It's, 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 it's a battle. They always battled each other. They always fought for each other's lands. Aye. And it's stupid stuff. So I think it's wild. It's almost like a... Like a, like a gene that's like it's a, almost like a belief system, though. I mean, this is my land, this is me, this is, I'm like to dominate myself. It's like something to believe in. Aye, it's just boys, I think. You never really know why you date when you're young. When you're, but it's died off now. But it's like back when we were dating, it was, it was before us, it happened for fucking hundreds. I mean, it happened for a good, it's happened since the days, not I mean, Culloden days, it's constant been boys fighting boys for here and all that. But it's like, it's just wired, isn't it? It's like an evolution, evolutional kind of thing. Mm-hmm. It's just wired. But they, I don't you think, why? You think, why? They couldn't stay, they didn't really know why they didn't. Right. It's like, like my post code, see when you couldn't score my post code, like, you did shout guy, but it didn't really, it wasn't it really about your scheme, it was just about the fight, that was all you wanted to do. Ah, just for something day, just out of boredom, really, yeah, was it? Yeah, but it's nowadays, we boys are fucking. 
singing about each other, you know I mean? It's a good thing though, do you know what I mean? This makes me feel better than my wee boy growing up, you know what I mean? Though, been a wee fan, you know what I mean? Then shit like, because I can deal with that, man, you know what I mean? A wee boy fucking. I worrying about going out and gang fighting that shit, but plus I know it's good, it's good and bad points to be your face with that, because obviously people are dead connected, so as before we had your fucking folklore cunts. You'd heard shit about cunts then you wouldn't see him be a gang oh, fight yeah. next time you'd see him in the street or not or get oh, him. Yeah, but now you can just you're in contact, you see cunts all the time, cunts can talk like click a finger. No, the thing no. is, it has got its downside, see for Wayne's and all man, let's see cyberbullying and all that oh, shit. Yeah, Wayne's yeah, got yeah. in their Xbox and fucking oh, Wayne, you know, Wayne's a lighter, cool oh, as fuck, and they don't know oh, they're saying they'll say, well, go kill yourself and that shit, no really realising the fucking oh, the, 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 the effect. The, I was talking to my, my missus today about that man, about fucking how a lot, you're hearing a lot of these wee boys now, like wee boy got fun, but it was last month in the forest and the pond and all that, wee boy was struggling with college and all that and he killed himself. Fuck's sake, he was fucking young. He must have been young, aye, but fucking it's just, what I can't be, you hear a lot of wee like young ones running away and I've seen a lot of it lately, I know. Ah, it's fucking, it's quite, it's, 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 it's an hour fucking pandemic, it's a wee guy for fucking, uh, didn't what, was doing Penny Levi, man, they fucking, uh, just does that, what, Bridget Park Park, is there a motorway, I think he was like 15, fucking aye. jumped off at Kilty Cell, man. Like, I think they're that age, man, that was never fucking aye. even in the fucking realms, I remember hearing about, see people talk about people who'd committed suicide, and I was aye. always thinking, why, like, what the aye, fuck, aye, that's a fucking, you know, it was a pure alien, alien. alien. Right, done it, but nowadays we guy, like your wains are doing it and all that, I mean, just need, need for any reason, do you know what I mean? Any reason, like, half of these petty things. Again, it's like, cause, I mean, that's their world, though. it's mad, mate, it's just mad. You know? yeah, it's, a, it's a different time we live in, see, with internet, man, yeah. and all your Facebook, you know, it's, it's, it's got so much, it's connected everybody at the same time, yeah, I know, yeah, but it's yeah. distanced everybody, it's, it's weird, it's, it's got a pure, it's like you're yin and yang and back to all that yeah, shit, you've yeah, got yeah. your fucking, you're too, it's weird, man, how yeah, it's, it's like, you've got so much good to come for something, but you've also got so much bad to come for yeah, as well. Yeah, definitely, you're constantly comparing, you know what you were saying, comparing yourself and all that, that's what they call it, these Instagram kind of influencers, you know what I mean, it's, and they don't, they don't really, it's not as if they're influencing, I mean it is influencing them, it's in a way, they're Aye. doing it for good, it's just influencing, the way they say influencing is that they're doing something that's like building art stuff and all that and they're teaching everybody they're to influence people to build art, these kids are taking pictures of themselves, like fucking pictures storing somewhere, they're calling themselves influencers, you know what I mean, this is just sort of is mate, it's influence, it's, I don't know, it's, it's, it's the, word, the word's there, you know what I mean, it's right there, it's there in these ways, you know what I mean, but it is in fucking, well, is that, this is the life you want, this is what you want today, uh, but it's uh, like, see a lot of these cunts, man, these cunts have just fucked up his ending, it's like, they're not, they're showing, they're getting a photo and they're showing they're sitting like fucking get a drink and all that shit man they're aye. fucking not even drinking but they're trying to show this life that they're not even living know what i mean as if aye, i've got the best life and it's like that's where you know a lot of people are feeling oh i'm not doing this i've not got a job i've not got a house aye. at 30 i'm not married i'm not this and nah, that I'm, I'm a fuck up and it's not unhappy, it? it's all just a, a social construct know what aye, i mean as you think it's just highlights so these pictures are highlights just because there's been somebody's got good ones get highlights in their life or have everybody's got good highlights you know think <coughs> back when Right back when you're away and there's highlights in your life you could put together in pictures if you did have the moments mm -hmm. to make your life look great but it's only a highlight, you know what I mean? There's Merkis going behind all that. Oh definitely, all it's, it's hard for people to see that, especially young people because you always think, yeah. think of yourself sometimes, I've, I've caught myself doing that a few times like the fucking, wish I was that cunt man and all that shit, but then you're like, that's kind of probably yeah. fucking, some people I remember looking at, you look at some people then fucking, Thinking, fuck you, look, this every time in their life, and fucking next thing you know, fucking done their selling. You're like, ah, yeah. fucking hell, I've never seen that yeah. coming. And that's when I realised, I'm like, ah, wait a minute, I shouldn't be fucking looking at these people. Yeah, yeah, because yeah. They, for yeah. all I know, they might be looking at me, or nobody yeah, looking yeah. at me. I don't really post there'll much. Be quality, there will be qualities, and see if you looked at this and you wanted their life, there'll be quality in you that they probably wish they had. Don't Definitely, know, man. Things, know what I mean? You could be content with yourself. These people are the content, they're constantly needing that. Like that, something like that. Like that something like that. 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 Like it's, it's mental, but fuck. Aye, it's just one of See if you're constantly, that's your constant, uh, you're looking for that fucking, what is it, you're fucking, uh, what's the word you're looking for? Self, self, what's it called? Fucking, when you're letting people, no, fuck no, I forgot the word. See what you're I'm trying to think, see, <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> see when fucking, obviously it's that kind of, you're wanting self, I think it's just reassurance. Self, it's like oh. you're wanting cunts just, that scene you're putting up, up putting up photos just so you can get the likes, so you can make you uh, feel good yeah, about yourself. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I got self-esteem. Uh, uh, just, yeah, like, yeah, just that self-esteem boost and you're constantly looking yeah. for it. That's the thing. If you're looking for that on social media, that's going to be, it's like a drug. Uh, it's your it's concept, you're going to be wanting that. You're not going to get your uh, film like that, right, I got 100 likes in that photo, that's me finished. Yeah, I don't need any more, but you're not, it's always, well, Andy, I feel shite, right, I'll get a photo. And it's, you're never going to be happy doing that shit, yeah, are you yeah, fucked, yeah. man? It's, it's fucking common sense, man. Yeah. And where does it go, as you say, it, it goes, 
only fans, all right. My other friends, I'll need to make it saucy yeah, and saucy. We have to make money off it though, when they do it. We fucking make a buck. No, I mean, if they can't do it, they make a buck. But that's it, man. You see, it's just it's, 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 the, the, the fucking the build up I'm talking about, but it's not the outcome. So how it, how, it, how it happens with this fucking, I mean, with Facebook and all that and Instagram. Right. How things happen gradually happen, do you know what I mean? Right, where it goes to, where it right. starts and that. It's weird, but it's it's a fucking weird time. We're living in a mad time because mm-hmm. there's, like, there's nothing before we can go back in history and look and compare it to because this, yeah, yeah, yeah. this is history yeah. right now. You know what I mean? It's known to yeah. maybe 20, 30 years down the line we're older. Like, I remember that. Yeah, this yeah. is a mad time. I think, uh, I think they might, because they're starting to get that now. See, you're getting... We're trying to create fucking community guidelines and all that shit on Facebook. You you ban for certain shit you say, like man. Stupid so, stuff and all that. If yeah, I get banned for fucking, I took a photo of a fan once. A fan, like a fan, you put uh, on the cool yeah. in. Aye. And I, I put it in a comment. And I tied the last one on. I went like that, and there was a man. I was like, that. Amanda's my big, uh, my second biggest fan compared to this cunt. And I get fucking nearly a ban for it because it was bullying. Uh, I was like, what the fuck, man? Who's doing this shit? Uh, who does but uh, I mean, I think it's going to get regulated in the next few years. It's going to get to a point where it's. It's so right now. I think we've got the. It's like we had the the freedom at phone. Now it's starting to get that strict way. But I think it's going to get a point. It's going to be that regulated as fuck. Aye. You know what I mean? They'll, they'll regulate it after sort of call me fucking ideology. Definitely, because like, it's going it's, that way. It's like it's pushing yeah, certain you see things and all that certain things. You know what I mean? It's like fucking. The minute you like COVID, see, minute you like COVID, the uh, fact check, it's like, see if somebody uh, mentions yeah, COVID no, or something, because no, no. that fact check, all this uh-huh. and that, I mean, it's like, aye, it's weird, man. Yeah. You go in fucking marketplace on Facebook to buy shit, man, it starts telling you, remember social distancing and all that, if you're reminding you, as if we're oblivious to what, what I mean, what's going on about us all the time, mate, but fucking man, I mean, it's, it's like, a, it's like another change in newspaper, mm-hmm. I think, like, like Facebook, uh-huh. and I think it's just like, ah, see, see, you ever seen, uh, what's that film with Tom Cruise, uh, it's fucking, is it artificial intelligence? He's in the future, he's a post in the future, and he goes and catches his cunt to get him. Does, does, does it repeat? Does it keep repeating? Is that the one? Ah, he keeps repeating. repeating. He's like, he catches his cunts before they murder somebody, so you get time. Aye. And they're walking about and they're reading papers, and the paper's changing as they're reading it. Aye. That's basically where we go, except aye. it's a phone. Aye. Is it, but it's a changing, you know what I mean? It's maybe a bit more complex than that, but it's pretty much the same aye, thing, aye, isn't it? Aye. But aye, it's fucking madness, man. It's aye. a crazy time. That is, mate, Facebook and all that. We asked that you are for you, I don't. Be on the hardest cunt to plan to get a hoda. Oh like, really? Aye. aye. Fucking like, see when cunts message me, mate. I'll just, just, I just patch the world sometimes, mate. You know what I mean, just go be content, fishing, going to spend time with the wins and all that. And I've always seen because a lot of time cunts are getting a hold of me for music and all that. And I'm just like, I'll just leave it and then I'll come back sometimes. You know what I mean? I'm not dinging them, I'm not intentionally going. I fuck them, just dinging them and the only message I need them. You know I mean, I'll have a conversation with people, good conversations, spend some time with them and all that. But then I get away. They all know. Everybody knows I go in the main thing. Do you know what I mean? Nah, you need it, you need it, you need it, especially with your family, man, you know what I mean? Plus, with your fishing, it's, see, you can, no, let's see if I go, if I go hill or climb a hill or something, man, and you yeah. pick out your phone, it pure ruins yeah, it, it you need, you need to get the phone to fuck and enjoy nature. Aye, the fishing teaches me that with the phone, man, because you pull your phone and your rod starts going and you don't see it, man, and you're pure pan, and it's like, oh, right, this fucking thing stays away, do you know what I mean? That's fishing's always taught me that, you can't, you need to be calling the ball, do you know what I mean? So when you go somewhere quiet, it teaches you to stay off your phone, mm-hmm. and so for that, fishing's one of the things that kept me away from you. Sitting right. there staring at phones and all that, right. you know what I mean? It's mere natural kind of stuff. Aye, it's too easy to do, man. It's, it's like a drug in itself, you know what I mean? It's always that wee fucking. Aye. It's a wee change. See, you're sitting bored, man. It's like, right, I'll look, maybe see something interesting. Aye, something aye. that might interest me, aye, something aye. that I can. I can Preoccupy myself with, you know what I mean? Aye. It's too convenient, you know what I mean? There is some good stuff you can sit on your phone. I've, I, do, I do do my research and all that, you know what I mean? I'll do research stuff and all that. Trying to fucking guns in my brain back, because obviously after all that, with the year, I just became dumb, you know what I mean? I, Fucking, I, I wasn't. I was articulate, not a new hunter. So good stuff and all that, mate. It was clued up. Good fucking educate cunts on mad shit and all that, mate. It was dead into deep, pure deep stuff and all that mm-hmm. and all. But then just after all that, mate, just vegged myself. You know what I mean? I turned into a pure veg. Do you feel that way? Just done that. Like that, 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 that fucking conversations and all that, mate. It was a different after it. You know what I mean, I was at least like been away again. It's like restarting. Then to fucking get back to being who I am. You know what I mean? It's because I think it's made of the fact of anxiety. We all the shit, know I mean? Anxiety was one of the reasons it does it on you when you're anxious, you become so fucking in, in yourself, you forget what you're you, you, you don't become strong. See, when you're, you're before that, you'd talk to you, you'd talk tight, but you'd puff up straight back, just you'd feel confident with yourself and all that. You would, but that was who you were, you knew who you were, but when you take stuff and all that, you start to forget who you are, and you start to think you're this person and that person, or you want that and you want this, and it's when you start, all the morals you teach yourself before it, it's like, you know what you want in life, you know what simple needs are and all that, you know what your responsibilities are, and then you start going, I want this, like you're talking about being flu, like you cunts have life and all that. It's kind of that same way you start believing you're meant to be something else, you start forgetting who you actually are and all that, mate. So you lose, you start getting dumb, you dumb yourself, it's becoming dumb, mm-hmm. you know what I mean? 
to say, cunts that don't read, don't, cunts that don't watch the telly are smart, you know what I mean? And then f- that's what they used to say, and that, but it's nowadays it's fucking nah, it's the same a, kind of thing. I know, man, I know exactly what you're talking about, man. I, is it the anxiety, I think, see, yeah, it does. I notice a lot of people seem to go back to these cold water retreats. A lot of the people that are doing it, because the cold water helps anxiety, and you find that a lot of these retreats, a lot of people are like experienced. Uh, yeah, and it's yeah, like, it's the thing. gear it does, because you think you're buying a fucking mad substance that's far fucking with chemicals up in your brain. But, but it's hanging, you know what I mean? I think it's, see the thing is as well, talk about creativity, see drink as well, see when I drink, I feel about a week later I'm kind of, it's like a block my creativity, but after about a week uh, I'm yeah, sound, I think yeah, that might aye. be playing a part in how you feel as well. Aye, the drink will be, aye, it blocks my creativity, but quite creative when I drink, you know what I mean? I can be, but a lot of tunes are right when I'm on drinking, man, it's like fucking quite depressing sometimes, or it'll be hip hop shit and all that, it's no stuff that stuff that's proper creative creative do you know what i mean it is stuff all right but is it just looks kind of straight out can i fucking see how it is can i that, that one i done the, the dirt mate that fucking one i stopped in soundcloud no longer ago i was fucking out my crack of steaming when i wrote that whole thing mate you know what i mean it was a good tune you know what i mean but it's a one half i can't tell myself that's the way i'll always be i know, you know, I know, I know so it. i start saying oh that's that's what you just keep feeding that you like myself like oh i'll, I'll drink and i'll fucking date i mean that's what i'm just that's what we'll talk about fuck that one can't keep doing things like you can't make it. Nah, it's too easy to get in a cycle that yeah. man, hundred percent. So yeah. have you got any plans to get back into the music again? Yeah, I mean, I've got a fucking that one that, well, I shared that club thing. What's that one called? You getting for it? Nah, no yet, mate. No, no, I don't. Know. Is that just, is just that mate, still kind of the what? I just it's funny, man. Nah, see where options, mate. Just you can pick a fucking just a word out of it and just like that's nah, it. It's called, not I mean. Just, still... The names are the worst bits, mate. It can take me fucking ages to make nah, names. It's not even the most important. You can fucking the name doesn't fucking the making the tune. No, I mean that's how it sounds. Have that band definitely done it, mate. It'd be good attention and all that, mate. So I fuck it. I was like, damn, mate. Just see if cunts like I look at a vibe for you. I'll be the wee clip here. That's when I'll go right. Fuck, I'll be. Do you know what I mean? I'll put my time here. See, they're just about if I was making like an album or something, just do it and I'll put it out. Or if I make odd tunes, I'll put them out. Do you know what I mean? But if I'm making something that I see genuinely, you know what I mean? I'll put when I do a good tune, a, a tune that goes on videos and all that, I mate. Mean, it's always something that's like worthwhile. Do you know what I mean? It's something you can believe in. You're like, ah, right, yeah, I've actually like fucking. Tune, this is, you know I mean? I'm going to add this to my actual fucking catalogue. I fucking hate right, tunes. My tunes, yeah, that's why. So I think this one I've got to do a club one, mate. Got a good video and all that proper. Do do this time, mate. Defo, is mate. You should make, cause when you sent it, I was buzzing off it, man. When you sent it, cause it was like, seeing you're telling us we were st- talking last night. Ah, oh, he feels if you've done just sell doings, if you've kind of lost crazy and that. And I heard it, and I was like, ah, I couldn't. Aye. It was like the same. That's the same kind of done hard man talk. It's the same aye, guy. Aye, aye. No, I mean, I was listening, to it, man. It was, it was like fucking as if you'd never fucking took aye, a day off. No, I mean, it was fucking brilliant. Then when know. you put it up and all, and I seen it was getting received well, and every cunt was loving it, man. I think every cunt, every cunt's been missing you see, cause you know, when it's active aye. on social media, obviously you say that yourself. Keep you keep away that man but i think it's because it's obviously everybody talks about you like, ah he's fucking let's see you're in the conversation if no class is like one of the best uh, if yeah, no yeah. the best no i mean you're always yeah. up there so if you are interested to hear what you're doing next no i mean yeah. people want to hear for you that used to worry me though man because of that but see when i done hard man talking that was before all my fucking all the mad shit so when i done hard man talking i was fucking i was free into it i mean creative as fucking all that so see when so this is happening they can't all the people don't see all that shit happening all the bother bad shit mate me getting doing the drain and all that all that mad fucking losing the plot and all that so there's when i'm fucking writing tunes and that and i'm writing constant shite and these cunts going oh he's the best and all that you're fucking one of the best and when you got to bring in their tune out and i'm just i panicked a lot mate I, I, there was a peer pressure now like, mm. like i've lost myself and i'm scared you know what i mean i had that opportunity to, I, the potential do you know what i mean and it scared me that used to be fear but proper scared me like i felt obliged to do it i had to, I had to make something i had to do Aye, you had to, you had to, you had to live up to that kind of fucking uh, what, living up to when somebody puts you up here man you're, 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 you don't want to be coming out doing here do you know what i mean you don't want to be flinging out i see a lot of cunts make tunes and they do it, obviously they, they keep making loads of tunes to get the attention man but i got the attention at first do you know what i mean straight away oh, so it was like i didn't have the time to build who i was it like but hard man thought it was like maybe this Second tune I wrote, or third tune, third tune I wrote. But ever, ever? Wrote, aye, ever wrote, <laughs> for fuck's sake, aye. man, you're joking. Fucking, but after obviously you had the one you wrote in your captain, that was that your top. That's the first one, and the motor with the red. Then t-shirt the second, and the, the, the fucking. The second one, I think the second one. What was the second one? I think it was. Eh, was that real talk? I think, but that was. Oh, I hate that tune, mate. It gives me the absolute heebie-jeebies here, not man. But done that. Eh, then a hard man talk, mate. I've done a few other wee things. I've always wrote fucking mad tunes, mate. Because we used to go to like, a wee studio doing an uh, white sinch fucking. Uh, power control studio it was called it was a, a guy called Carrie Kay mm-hmm. and Steve uh, they were talking class kids man they, they were bang they used to go up there they used to just do like wee ciphers and all that man. Mm-hmm. They were, they, that's where I recorded hard man talk and that they were good cunts mate and that's where I kept my music was alive then do you know what I mean like I had a good wee group and all that it was a cunt called Astronomic and uh, Kid Robotic and all that he was mm-hmm. here and uh, 
guy called Dale as well. He was the one that introduced me to the cunt. Dale didn't even do it. He really a musician. He just mad weed guy. He was a man of the mad weed guy. Oh, he was a local dog dealer. No, he was the local. He was like a connoisseur, mate. One of the good guys. You know what I mean? Fucking, that was speak him and it was a weird one to meet and I was fucking fishing, it was a random, it was a random, didn't know who he was and he's messaging like, where are you? And I'm like, I'm fishing at Kilburnie, he's like, I'll come see you. And I'm like, this is weird as fuck. Kid pulls up, man, he's got the sun specs on, he gets out the big jeep now, he's like, what's happening boys? And he's like, jump in. So we jumped in, we jumped in, got the fishing gear on this kid, don't know who he is. He's like, so we got a smoke man, he pulls out all these wee bags of different weed, mate, and I'm talking like a full train, and I'm like, oh, fuck, I'm hitting a badge in here, man. <laughs> but the cunt was that, I mean, that cunt, it was one of those, like, I used to always believe in that law of attraction kind of thing, mate, where just people just pop in. Right. And uh, he popped in, mate, and he's the one that got me into the, mate, fucking into the studio, mate, they recorded hard man talking, all that, you know what I mean? And one of the so things, through mate, him, was so random, him. mate, do you know what I mean? The hard man talk wouldn't existed. Wasn't it for him? So how did he, did he just appear fucking... Just a random guy, mate. Just a random guy. So just came up to you when he was off fishing? Aye, aye, aye. He no, messaged me through, through, obviously through my music and that. Ah, I see, aye. Uh, he, he, he introduced me to a boy called uh, Tarpey and Scott. Scott. Aye, he was Scott McKenzie. He, he was met, I was going to get him a mural there, man. Aye, I was going to get him a date, man. Aye, but I ended up passing it. He's class. Ah, he's brand new. He introduced me to him and all, mate. And he's fucking a dead and hard man. It's like weird one behind a chain reaction of events, you know what I mean? That's what it was good music, man. Kind of died after that, or left, kind of stopped going, you know what I mean? And that's when it all started getting bad with the drinking drugs and all that. Basically, the drugs, again, no drink, but mm -hmm. that was it. Man, drink, yeah, drink, 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 maybe the drugs came as a part, see, obviously, you're saying you felt pressure after the hard man told yeah. you, that was maybe why you started to feel bad. No, I went, they, when I went to the gigs and that, mate, when I was doing it, that, that euphoric, like, performance, when I did the gig, when I went up and cunts listened and cunts were like gone, and I was like, I used to get up, you're like, that. there's no comparison to feeling like I've watching cunts enjoy your shit live, right? Like, there's something about it, right? That's a but fucking drug in itself. You get so excited, like, like I fuck it, I'll take that, fuck, fuck it, I'll try it, let's do it, you're all fucking in a cheery way, and it? it's all pleasure, and then you take that, you think it's even better pleasure, but it's no, it's fucking, you're in it, oh, mate, you're all the shot you're taking, I was taking fucking all sorts of mad shit, mate, like, Mate, fucking, I don't even want to fucking say what I was fucking taking, man, but... I get, I get it gets mental uh, pretty quickly, man. It goes, it, goes, it goes for like uppers, mate, to something extreme, you know what I mean? It goes for extreme, it's mad shit, mate, but it's fucking, it's, mate, it's mad, mad, mate. You can just fucking, how quick it can just happen, you know what I mean? Ah, that one time, you think, it's, it's good, mate, you know what I mean? You end up there for a couple of days, but they used to be dead fragile and all that. First, obviously, that's when I started realising that, see that? Never experienced that, that way, when you've been up for days and all that, for drug, never had that, you know what I mean, back then? So... Every time I came through there, I was looking forward to it, and it would happen frequently. And I stopped going there altogether. And I was going to Glasgow, doing gigs in Glasgow. McCall's, I was there at like gigs, it was just like open mic kings and all that. I'd go to McCall's all the time. And uh, I was fucking sniffing line with gear all the time, mate. I was driving up there, fucking sniffing gear. Sometimes I was fucking turning off a couple of pints, mate, and firing down the road and all that, mate. Steaming. I was going right. to Edinburgh, it started to do. Well, that's when I knew I was getting bad, mate. I was taking my motor. Places. I was taking a motor to Edinburgh, mate, and getting steaming and driving him for Edinburgh, steaming and all that. Fuck's sake, mate. That's when I knew I was like going. Like, that's how I used to tell my pals the motor on that. They would, I used to think it was funny, and they didn't, you know what I mean? And that's how I fucking pushed every kind of way because I was going after the you know what I mean? Went after the and it was fucking. McCall's and that done gigs in there. Yeah, but I'd always ruin it, I'd ruin different person for me. I went to Perth to do a gig and all. And, uh, I can't remember what it was the name place. I went up to do that man, I ended up sniffing uh, Mandy and all that. Oh, uh, I fuck sake. Did you drive up there? No, no, I got a lift up there. Ah, was right. where, my boys, I was supposed to do my set and cunts the door started appearing for me, like, 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 hear me and all that. And I'm like, ah, just you cunts like, you're next. And I was like, ah, I'm not doing my set. And I'm just doing my bin. I was doing, I was just rather get fucking fuck of drugs and fuck the music now, you know what I mean? It go to the point that it was a part of music. I go to the point where fuck music. Ah, I mean, fuck just gets fuck for it. That's just, I just want to get fully now and... You know what I mean, just talking that, that's why it was, mate. It was fucking, it was fuck, aye, it was fucking mad music, done it, and then we left music, music left me. Yeah, I came fave music, then I music, and they're getting patched. But that's how it was like, because I was like that fucking, I was right into it when I was in the jail, wrote, wrote two albums worth and all that, man. Yeah, and then I got yeah. out, and the day I got out, I was on the gear, and that was me. And it's yeah, weird seeing that sniff gear, it was weird. I, get, I care about cunts, I don't care about cunts, it's like, if I'm that fuck playing a guitar and all that shit, then. Cause I've get I've realised now, see if I sniff gear, I'm a fucking no creative at all for about a week uh, or something. Yeah, you can't, but at the time yeah. I'm like, I've got a pure writer's block, I can't do this, and uh, I just yeah. end up patching it, and then I'm just getting on it all the time. Uh, and it was a, I've obviously found my way back to it, but it was after coming half a gear. Now I, I, I know myself well enough. I'm like, yeah, if yeah. I take gear, it's, it kills my creativity for it about does. a week. It makes me know what to be arsed in it. I know that's the drug it's doing it, but uh, I yeah, just yeah. it does it fucking. There's an effect on you for longer than that. You Time, you know what I mean? It's crazy, see when you put down the like, fucking for how long you take it, you take it for a couple of hours, 
hours and it's fucking a couple of days you're fucking oh, feeling it man I know I mean it's, it's because of the serotonin and that's what they say you can take it and it's friends that fucking over the over so, I mean right up there you know what I mean and then when you're after it you come after it you know what I mean you're that week it's those serotonin zone at zero mate there's no that's the one that makes you happy and content and all that thing that gives you that week and a buzz you know what I mean mm-hmm. so that's, that's that your step uh, that's at zero it's at zero for the full week I think so, they say three days I think there's a three day thing or something they call it whereas you'll regret it the next day deny it the, the day after that and then on the third day you forget it and you forget what it was like all that the feeling like that and that's and then the fourth day is usually when you'll do it again that's what it's, that's what it's an old saying thing aye, the, the three day thing it's always three days it's weird how aye. I feel how I often find that it's like the next day I'll regret it, but the next day after that I'll, I'll feel as if I'm still a bit charging yeah. then the next day, no, then that's when I come down, I'll, cry, I'll, I'll crash. crash into like yeah, three yeah. days later, it's weird. Times I've crashed like a week later my heat's been up my ass, it's like it's yeah. weird, I've, I've been alright then it's like a week and I'm like, ah, what the fuck, what kind of fucking drug? No. I take it then a week later, right? it's like, it's like imagine drinking a fucking get mad with it, then a week later you get a high over. Uh, yeah, but I would be know. fucking mental on it. Uh, it's but it's like fucking with gear, it's fucking it's uh, meant as a mad fucking drug. It does, I can't fucking eyes uh, fucking it's just that's fucked. Ah, uh, it's defo, it's one yeah. for fucking. Don't take it. Uh, don't t- don't <laughs> listen to my songs, I just say it as a laugh, mate. Uh, but I mate, you should defo's fucking get right back into music because maybe obviously uh, you've got your obviously you've got a lot of passions in that, but it is it's a good we think is that's what I feel with the music and all see I focus on it, that's what keeps me on the straight and I can I know see if I get mad with that, I'll I'll yeah, fuck yeah. it and I'll put it to the back. I, I know I will fuck it and I'll patch it for a week, yeah, you know. Yeah, and yeah. I'm no one that it's like it is, it's my week and I, it's like my thing I can do that I'll know it'll keep me on the straight and I can yeah, I think, yeah, know yeah. what I mean? It's I can focus on. Like your vice, it's all right. That's it, your vice, man. Definitely, this is my music, and that's kind of my drug now, you know what I mean? It's like I found a way I get an astral high writing tunes and that shit. Like, nothing better than you write a tune, you're like, that's a fucking good tune. You get that dopamine, you're like, that's a fucking, I've got this, and it's like, you get that your moment, you're like, yes, man. It's good day feelings, man. That's amazing. I've had a lot of day feelings in a long time, mate. Fucking that one, you're like, mate, they're still, mate, they're still there to happen. I think good tunes, now, but it's nothing like fucking, like, you 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 can't even believe it. You you laugh at the fuck, man. You get on your repeat. You get one good bit, and you just repeat that bit for a good fucking ten minutes ah, solid because you can't even believe how good that one bit was. And you're like, oh, that's mental. Uh, the next day you've got a wee buzz. You're like, ah, yeah, fuck, ah, you wake up, wake up straight away, and you're wanting to go and date straight away to hear it again and all that. Ah, so I mean, it's fucking, fucking nothing better. But I mean, because sometimes I know I'm like to myself, right. Right, I've, I've wrote this, it's fucking dynamite. Right. Then next time I'm like to write a tune, I'm like, ah, okay, it's no as good as that, I, I must be shy, you getting that mad thing right. me, but it's like, aye, mate, it's like fucking, it's always there, it's always achievable, it's your brain, if it, it came from the same place, if right. it can it's come from it once, true, it can right. come again, it's like, I think right. it was, a lot of it is on the head, but I, I defos, mate, she defos get back pursuing it, mate, you know what I mean, even if it's no as much like pure dedicated right. focus, right. man, it's like, we fucking think you kind of, Keep you keep you motivated and yeah, that kind of yeah, stuff, yeah. and plus and all, like when you put action out there, yeah, you're into action. Look at the, the reception it goes. Yeah, you know yeah, what I mean? No, I Maybe once you put that out, you'll be okay to be buzz again, yeah, man. I, I was up, I was up. Was, uh, I've got a tune with Shogun. I know we done. It was a nine minute number, man. I was up. With guy Tony Smoke, man. He's a good cunt. That guy for Cash Smoke. No, no, he's another guy. I can't think of what Tony Sparrow. Tony Smoke. Is it a guy who got a stood on his gaff? Aye, aye, aye. Shogun tells about him. Oh, yeah, he's right. Tony's a top class guy. We should have done a should be Shogun and that, but he was listening to him, seeing you like Shogun, man. He knows what he's talking about. He's fucking. Ah, he's, 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 he's I spoke to him on the phone aye. for about an hour and a half, man. He's aye, fucking he's a really clever boy, boy, man. Aye, he's, he's fucking proper. He's good, he's good, to, he's good to, when I was up talking to him and all that, he's fucking, don't I mean, he's. He's, he help, he's wants to help, you know what I mean? He knows he do, right? if you've got potential. I mean, if he sees a potential, he would, he's like one of the ones, but if you're just if you're just fucking about, you're not going to listen, you know what I mean? You know, he's not a daft cunt. Right. You know I mean, he is, he's fucking smart. Like, he's I fucking know, I was that when I was on the phone to him, man, he was talking, <coughs> man, he's, he's dead. Yeah, he's, he's fucking well opinionated, man, but he's talks and you can hear he can hear him passionate as fuck. Uh, he is passionate, he doesn't give a fucking horse, he really tells you something, it's like that's it. I mean, it's yeah, it, it, a truth, but he says it how it is. Yeah, he's, he's, he's experienced it, you know what I mean? He's, he's worried. He had everything sitting on his back straight away, mate, bit of music in Scotland, you know what I mean? You fucking hurt there, like, millions of views and all that, man. Nah, yeah, yeah, because for a young age as well, you know what I mean? Yeah. Probably yeah. likes yourself, maybe yeah. not so young, but with like, a hard man, it was like your one of your first outings, you know what I mean? And it did get put in that pedestal, yeah, so it's yeah. like, fuck, I need to Stay live up to what people think, camera. I know, I know. Mental, mate, right? But fucking Sherlock, I know, man. He makes good, he's like me, I know, man. He makes a good few tunes and then disappears for a couple of years, man. And he, I, I, I'm like his fan, mate. I fucking love Sherlock, I mean. I know Michelle has tunes word for word. No, I mean, aye. Aye, we used to put that fucking his scheme living tune on the voters going camp, man. Every camp would be feels screaming at me. I didn't know you meant it. Oh, if you're not for bins, mate. Well, tunes, I, tune, I still love that tune. I love all his tunes, man. 
Aye, uh, yeah. stuff's class, man. It's God's obviously a wee brief fight isn't it? You learn, man. But I hope they yeah. start to make music again, definitely. Aye, it's good. To. Really, like people that see that you get like there are a lot of Scottish rappers, but there's a few. It's in the kind of I think it's in the the kind of uh, in the talking in the line that could actually make this an actual phenomenon. Uh, kind of ones that stick to their sound and make rap with their own voices and accents and make up and find their own I mean structures and all that. So they're just copying and pasting some kind of else for somewhere else. You know what I mean? The only ones that put proof on it though. Uh, the kind who has been up there has, has comes out with like. The rain sound, you know what I mean? You get boy Podgy for Podgy for uh, Edinburgh. Edinburgh, aye. I mean, he's fucking Disney. Can we Disney do it? And he doesn't cover copy any cunt. You can hear when you, you can even somebody's got I mean, it's, it's, it's a copy based job in these cunts, but when somebody's got natural talent, you know what I mean? And they've really, really looked at that paper mm-hmm. or their phone and just went, fuck it, you know what I mean? Then I've made a tune and it's all came straight free here. There's been no thinking, oh, we'll like, date like that. Or, there's just a constant flow, don't want to the things that these cunts. You can always, I can see, you can see that talent straight away, do you know what I mean? All the time. Like, well, you do your, you do the split the guitar and all that. The fucking the, the singing and all that. It's you. It's not. It's none of that fucking putting on mad American accents. Aye, like, well, that's the thing. That's what I mean. I honestly see. When I first started writing tunes. I always used. To, I sang that mad transatlantic accent. Uh, that was just because yeah, the tunes yeah. used to listen to. And uh, I was in the jail. Uh, I got a holiday a Las Vegas album. Uh, I was listening before and they were singing. Uh, uh, they were singing a uh, Scottish accent, but singing tunes like Go Square Go, singing it Square Goes, and getting chased by the Baltic, yeah, yeah, Baltic yeah. fluter up my arse, and I'm like, ah, right, so I can write tunes like that? Yeah, People can that. do that, and it works. Uh-huh. And that's when I started writing the way I write, and then uh-huh. I just end up adopting it and just singing it my own way. Now I'm like, ah, see, now I'm like, ah, why, why, why? I wouldn't want to sing this any other way. It's good that you find your inspiration way someday, like Scottish, you know what I mean? That's, uh, that's I, what you say. These people are inspired by fucking cunts of England or America, so their inspirations are there. They're, they're, when they're trying to make the talent of their man, they're inspired, it's affecting them, do you know what I mean? But having somebody, if you're having a good inspiration, and somebody who's the same as you, you know what I mean? Seeing some kind of rapping, that's what I think we are, that's what I've always hoped that when somebody hears me, like we guys hear me, or anybody hears me, if you're Scotland and they hear me, or like hear, say like fucking like Sherlock, Shogun, all the, all the real ones, you know what I mean? They, you know, Fucking they hear them, they'll go, ah, I can do that, I can do that. Well, I, you have seen it, I've been seeing it, see, ever since we did come about. I remember country used to listen to Scottish rap, I was young, and I'd listen to Scottish rap, and go, listen to the state of that, man. But fucking, like, I mean, it was just because it was just ridiculed, man. 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 Rappers listening to rappers in Scotland, mate, a lot of time it was, wasn't really a big thing unless it was some cunt. There was cunts, let's say, like to a mob, mate. I've been at parties and that, I've met grown men who knew who mob was and that, for free rapping. That's all the cunt they've You say Scottish rap, they've been bitched, I'm not, I mean, you get Loki as well. He done a lot. He was really big, Loki, and then you get Mad Hat as well. They were the three, they were the three, they were the three kind of main ones. But they done it with the proper accents. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. They're in accents, but then you get the other ones that were all kind of that. American, all kind of fucking. I think it's because there was only the three them seeing. Because obviously back then the Scottish rap wasn't they, as taken seriously. It was a case that they weren't listening to as much. But as now, see, there's more and more people starting to come. They're actually talented people. It's not just kids rapping for the sake of it, kids. And that's what I was thinking. I was about to say as well. See, we were talking about if you're young ones here, like here, not use. You're rattling about what, what shit they can relate to, it's shit their lives and all that, but you're doing your accent and it's sounding right. dynamate, then like that. It's like me talking about listening to Las Vegas, like I can do that and it can sound good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And that's what leads that inspiration. So I, yeah. def was, man, I think it's going to snowball 100%. But I, def was, you need, well, you need to get yourself back into it, man. I think I, def was, mate, because you, you, you've got plenty more in the fucking barrel. I think, def was, mate. I think the fucking the story's not even fucking begun yet for you, man. Uh, Plus, and also, what's this, this tune with Shogun? So is it like a cypher? No, it's just a nine minute number, mate. So are you going to release it? Nah, but I'm going to edit it. I need to go and sort the beat and all that, mate. We're going to try it. We think they were changing the beat, but I love the beat so much, mate. It's one of the big means. Can I mainstream you? Can I beat, man? The cunts want an absolute fucking packet for it, you know what I mean? So uh-huh. just buy the best, I'll buy the best right state, you know what I mean? They, they, they stems now, because it's quite, it's, it's made it be the beat. It's just, I just can't see any different, mate. It's uh-huh. a tune in the uh-huh. You've just like, been bought into that much, man. It's like, if you uh-huh. hear it with something else, but like, nah, uh-huh. it's just not the same. I was going to record myself, mate, and then he done his bit, mate, and all that. It was fucking, I was like, ah. This is like, I was one of the tunes I was listening to after it. I just kind of believed that there was that it was a tune, you know what I mean? It, was, it sounded that good, good. It's a good tune, mate. I mean, I bashed it up like, first, I'll bash it the new, you know what I mean? And it's still, it's like a tune I listen to as if it's no me, you know that? Aye, it's, it's, mental, it's right? good and you get, I get so many tunes with myself, man. I just like, sometimes like, listen to like that cow called cocaine, man. I was always yeah, happy I when I wrote that and I listened back to it and I'm like, ah, fucking hell, man. It's like pure, it's always, every time you hear it, it's like the first time you've heard it. Yeah, yeah. It's like just pure, you just love it, man. Yeah. It's, it's like a wee ego sort of times, you're like, ah, I'm fucking having hate on that. It's good that you see me, you ever get bored or something. Sometimes you're mad at it, man. You go back and look at all your old shit, all the stuff you've made, and you just sit fucking spend doors like you're like, oh, this is bagging and all. Ah, I like that. Sometimes that's a good time. Some good times, mate. You've a few cans, and you're like listening to all your old tunes and all that. 
you start thinking, oh, but the Wayans are going to see these, they were there older and all that. It's going to be pure proud, you're pure proud and all that. Ah, you've done, you've done well and all that. Well, you've got that shit, man. I definitely, because it's, it's building like a back, because that's the way I see we make music as well. It's like you're building like a, it's like something you can look back at. It's like you're writing a fucking story Aye. for yourself. It's like maybe not written in words, it's written in so many words, but it's like, it's like a book, but it's Aye. like you can listen back to it. But for fucking 20, 30 years down the line, you're sitting Aye. old and that shit. There's people who are. Getting the 60, busted their arse all their life, body off, fucked for doing jobs uh, they hated. Not to show just, for it. Uh, not to show for it, turn to the drink, not shit. You can, we can uh, look back and go like that. Fucking hell, this is where you listen. That's what I like about music as well. Uh, yeah. It's like, it's not just a sound, it's like therapy. It's fucking, it's so many different things. Uh, it's plus right. and all, it's like you listen back to it. It's like, you, you ever hear a tune, you just like that, ah, fucking hell, and it reminds you, it brings back memories for uh, yourself. Yeah, like it's, that. It's, just, it's, like, it's like fucking living a moment, you hate listening to it, man. Uh, it's, that's why I went to. But I'll be able to look back at my fucking body. I what my I created that. That was Aye. me. This I'm listening to this was me at a point in life. Aye, definitely. There's no many people can actually see it. Even there's no many people actually can say they can do it. There's no people who do something like that a day. It's a, a unique king. No, I mean it's a gift. No, I mean and it's death always me. If you've got it, man, fucking grab it with both hands and fucking use it. Pursue it, man. As you say, you got, don't take life for granted, man. Aye, hundred percent, mate. Hundred percent. Definitely. Therefore, so what's the plans for you in the future then? If you thought that far ahead, you still take one day at a time. One day at a time. I'm aware of doing a plan things, mate. I plan something never happens anyway. I can relate to that, my man. I'll have a one-week king, mate. I'll get up the Monday and go fucking eat. What? It needs to be done, mate. You know what I mean? Aye. Fucking, this needs to be done that fucking week. Do you know what I mean? It needs to be done rapid. Aye. So for a fact, though, next week I'll be doing something totally different. Aye. Just always on to the next thing, man. I'm kind of the same, man. It's one of ones because that's what I feel. Yourself as well. I feel as if you're seeing me talking about ADHD and that kind of thing, you're always just looking for <coughs> see something with the music. You get a lot of people today, they, they do their styles and they, they never move out of that, they never try anything different. Uh, I think you're yeah. the one who wants you always want to kind of you're looking for something, can yeah. experiment, something different, something new to kind of spark uh, your yeah, interest, yeah. know what I mean? Mm-hmm. Definitely, yeah, it's fucking. But I fucking all sorts of shit, man. It's fucking erratic. But yeah, I can fucking one day I want to be a for one day I'm sometimes I'm looking at boxing things. I'm like, I've got to be a boxer. I'm going to get any boxing and all that. <laughs> going to get any fights and all that. Mate. And then a week later I'm patching it. And I'm like, nah. I was like, it's all fucking. I'll do something else, mate. I'll fucking. All the time, mate, I look at for I done used to do well detecting and all that, mate. See, well detecting, I used to think it was pure weird, my papa got one. It's like, I'm not going to be able detecting and all that. I don't know why. Go home, so we started doing it. The beats, man, like, digging away, mate, digging big holes and that. Fuck it, it's just, my, it's iron, it's iron, but it's iron and that. You think, no, fuck, we're looking for coins and all that. So I fucking thought it was no bad. So I'm like, I get home and searched it and all that. I'm watching videos, I couldn't find any old things, like fucking old hammered coins for like the year 1500 and all that. Mm. And, all sorts, mate. And that was pure mate. Oh, and shit. I, was, I was obsessed with it for about a year and a half, mate. Fun, all sorts, mate. I've got some career. I've got shit that's fucking like three, four hundred year old and all that. Really? Mate. Coins, I all pure. I've got me packs and all that. All nice. Got a pure full setup, mate. Yeah, but my thing, one of my things, I do all and all that. I buy a milk detector, but I'm never happy with something, mate. I've always got to keep get the next one up and then the next one. Ah, I've the best of the best. I've got to conjure all my money and buy something else, mate. And then I see the end. I always sell it, mate. I do it all the time. I didn't. I get any mountain biking. I've got this a hard tail bite, a wee shitey Apollo thing, then it just builds up to the next mate, and I've got to go. I've always got to go the full length, mate. I can never just be content with something. Sometimes, Aye. sometimes I've, I've, I've got that bad habit, and I'll get the best thing ever. I've achieved it, and I've got it. I used to have a bite, the good, my favourite bite, mate. I can do it every morning and touch it and all that, and I go past it. <laughs> it's hard to hold the horror bars and look at the wheels and all that, mate. You're about the living room, just walk it about, don't jump on it, just walk it about. I just sit in it and all that, mate. But I've got good bites, mate. You know what I mean? And, a week later, I'd sold it and I'd be pure gutted, mate. I just <laughs> just sold it for because I wanted to do something else. And it was a new thing I wanted to just do. Just got the next thing, man. No, all the time, mate. I'm fucking erratic as fuck. Just a man of extremes. Constantly wanted to do something else, mate. That's fucking always oil a shot. Nah, but it sounds like it's exciting, but no, I mean it's funny yeah. ones. It is. It's like it's fucking. It's always interesting. No, I mean. Aye, I like that fucking. I can't imagine. Maybe it's like a comfort zone kind of thing. I like to. I like to constantly be satisfied. You know what I mean? I think. That's what it is, mate. See, if you can't settle, you know, you never settle. You start it's like, running out of things today, and that's what, that's probably one of the reasons why I had to drink a raw meat. You start running out of ideas, not I mean, there's only so much you can do for the running of them, not I know, it's, it's crazy, but I'm, I'm kind of like that myself, but it's crazy to see with the baby and that. That's one thing you can never really go, oh, I'm sick of that and just never stop that again. It's one of the ones you always get back to, man. It's fucking to, brutal, aye. man. Aye. You think to yourself, I tell myself, my brain, I'm like, ah, right, if I can do that, my brain can do it with one thing, surely it can do it with another. No, nah, I mean, yeah, yeah, I, could, well, I could ponder shit like that, I'm like, right, it's nah. all coming from the same place. Aye, well, same place, I know, but you, you'd always argue yourselves if there's somebody else in there, you know what I mean? It's always like, 
it's going on here, you know what I mean? You're, you're, you're telling yourself not to do something, but then you're doing it, and you, know, and you regret it, and then like, as if it's no you that done it, you know what I mean? It's all the one person. That was me with the fucking biscuits earlier on, man. I'm yeah. sitting, I'm sitting, my ass swear to God, I'm actually contemplating grabbing one, and I'm like, wait a minute, mate, what are you thinking? <laughs> like, start this, mate, you were fucking, mate. See, before you came in, mate, I was pure gut, eh? I was pure getting after, man, like, I'm a scumbag, I felt like a pure <laughs> rat bag bastard. I was pure slaughtering myself and all that, man. No, I was like, man, they fucking digestors were banging. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Tours, lads. Tours, mate. Aye, yeah. mate, it's been fucking emotional, mate. It's been brilliant, mate. But Defo's, mate, I really want to hear Murphy, man. I'm sure every country's watching does, mate. So yeah. Defo's fucking stick at it, my man. 100%. You've got it, man. Defo's 100%, mate. But it's been a pleasure talking to you, my man. It's been fucking beautiful, bro. We'll get you on again sometime in the future, obviously, seeing your fucking goat stuff to promote that. Aye, come on, mate, and fucking get into it. I'm sure we've just scratched the surface, man. We're a buzz, man. It's been a pleasure talking to you, bro. Are you taking one of your tits? We'll get one. Cheers, bro. Premade, the tits, Pat. Cheers, bro. 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 Cheers